Yeah, that's true. Hi! Hello, everyone! Hi, how is everybody doing? Hello, hello! Welcome! Hi! How is your guys' day going? Hello! Welcome, 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 welcome! Okay, we might have a change of plans. I might, I might play something else instead of Power World. How's everybody doing? How are you guys doing? I hope you guys are having a good day. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Hi, Manny Man. Hi, Angel. Hello, everyone. Hello, hello, hello. Are you guys excited for the weekend? Happy Friday. I think maybe we'll play some Genshin. Then. Alright, let's do that. How is everybody doing today, though? I hope you guys are having a great day. Thanks for coming. I slept in like super, 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 super extra today for today's stream and I am still super pooped. This cold is taking it out of me. Oh my goodness gracious. Just absolutely taking it out of me. But you know, it is what it is. We out here. We, we ready for a good stream. I'm excited for tomorrow. Like super, super excited for tomorrow um because tomorrow we're gonna be doing new year's wishes and i think that that's gonna be like super exciting and i'm really excited for that and uh our little dadama dolls isn't it cute do you guys see the dadama doll right there dadama doll right there <laughs> it's so cute we're also sponsored today by uh star trek um <clears throat> and it's, i'm i'm really excited so uh by star trek fleet command so if you guys want to get a jump on that, we're going to be playing it a little bit. If you guys want to get a jump on leveling up. You guys can download using um, that. Um, or check in the description down below. It's super exciting. I'm really grateful to uh, have a, another sponsor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How's everybody doing? Let me pull my nose. I'm so sorry, chat. Okay, I was gonna play some, uh, <laughs> I was gonna, uh, I was gonna play some, I was gonna, I was gonna play some, uh, some Power World today, but, uh, Karate has to get up early in the morning and I want to keep her up. Ooh. So we here, we here, all right. Get them primo gems. I haven't played in a few days anyway. I've been super naughty. Long distance love. Something seems to be tra Oh, what is this? Random. <laughs> random quest over here. Ooh woo. Okay. You're missing the primos. Is there some every day? Have I been missing them? Uh, if so, it's okay. It's okay. <laughs> it happens. I just like have been like either stream or sleep or working on stuff and I, I haven't sat down. You're right. I am missing out, but oh, there's only eight days remaining, but we have seven days. It'll be okay. It'll be okay. 
it, Chad. We can do it. We can do it. Okay. Um, let's finish up all of our, our Le Levi stuff. Oh, well, the Welkin. That's true. I keep forgetting. It's okay. But how is everybody doing, Manny Man? I'm ready for Sunday. Is that your day off? I had to squish a roach for my, for my mom. I'm just playing the Genshin events right now. Got my free gaming. Yay! Wait, you got a free one? Or does he come? Does he, like, happen to be, like... Um, or whatever. Is this a random event, like, in the world? Or is this always here, I wonder? Very cute. Um. But hi! Hi, Fading. Hi, Manny. Hi, Angel. Hi, everyone. Nerva uploaded another emo. It's supposed to be the Dadama doll. Let me know if you guys see it. Wait, you only have Sundays off? You work so much! So much, so much! Sorry, I was adjusting something. Okay. Ah. I'm ready to go, even though I'm kind of sleepy. Oh, you get a free one from the event? Ah, that's super exciting. Gotta do the event stuff to gain points. Easy to get right now. Uh, I'll have to do it once we... We have 30 days for it, at least. Oh, anyway, can we? I'm I'm surprised. Manny Man is, is bless him. Such a hard worker. Yo, Lulu, thank you for the subby. You broke my VTuber already. <laughs> thank you so much. How are you doing? Thank you so much for the subby. Hello, hello. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Hi! Thank you for 20 months! I literally don't deserve you! How are you doing? Uh, oh, it's a digital event. Thank you so much! I hope you're having a lovely day! Oh! I was I know I know you can mute it. It just I can't the it is banger music. I, it doesn't let you mute it until you through the dialogue. Move on dance to get the achieved the renown in Leeway Harbor. Thank you so much, Avenger, for 42 freaking months! How are you doing? Hello, 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 Nelzo, hello, welcome! Thanks for coming and hanging out. It doesn't let us mute it. Before you confirmed? Okay. Uh, oh, we're looking for him? Under the dancer? Oh, I see, okay. Okay. Um, click the button to see which the event. I just want to be able to mute. I guess I, I lowered it. It's fine now. Click the man chat icon to return to gaming. Ah, oh, there's two events! Oh, there's so much stuff. I wish you could just lower it, like... 
Oh, well. Anyway, how is everybody doing? Good, thank you so much. I hope you've been well, Avenger. Lulu, how have you been? Tell me all the tea. Gain silk. The dancing beast, uh, to be the shrink bean. So, how do we unlock it? We need to do, okay. The daily stuff, commissions. Uh, share the web event once. Like. <laughs> click it. Oh, it's loading forever. That we'll do it that way. Does that count? Copy the link. There we go. Ta-da! Don't worry, Fading. This isn't my first rodeo. No, hi, trains. I just realized you guys were out here. Bonk, bonk. I don't deserve all this love. I'm gonna cry. Dude, share to me. I need to start it. It's okay. You just click the little share button and they'll never know. Hi. Ryzen, Genshin in back. Uh, visit the Twitter. Okay, we'll go to the Twitter. We'll do the daily stuff. Oopa scoopa, presents, big booty brains, okay? <laughs> Solve the puzzle. Complete the puzzle to a total of two sections. How do we do more puzzles? Yeah, what do we do? We, can we just unlock this now? Confirm. Okay, level two puzzle. I'm in the afternoon. A good snack deserves paired with fine quality tea. Uh, which is self required the right type of water, the ideal temperature, and the correct number of brews. The perfect tea together with snacks of the finest texture. Okay, so we have to guess which food is often eaten as dim sum. The village? Yay! They look too sharp <laughs> to be dim sum. All right, Primo Gems, Primo Gems, cute. Cute, cute, cute. All right, so we just need to keep doing daily missions and then we can eventually unlock more puzzles. Yeah. Okay, what about the other one? Now I feel weird without the music. We'll have to turn it, we'll turn it back on. I love that it tilts. It's so pretty. Oh, these are more puzzles. I see. Okay, well then we can't do any more. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Gaptoons, hello, how are you doing? Thanks for coming and hanging out. Hi. Hello, hello. All right, all these notifications are gonna drive me bonkers monkers. Uh, so I just gotta click it all. Hi, Psychotic! How are you doing? You gotta remember about the web event to finish it. Yeah. It does remind you, though. At least, like, every day it feels like. I've done the other ones. Like, the, the washing one or whatever. Um, so... Let's see. 16 days left for the main one. We have plenty of time. Okay, let's finish the leeway stuff. I seen that you have another. I do, Raptor. I still sound. If I relax my voice, I still sound like a growly, like old lady. It's annoying. <laughs> the daily events are the best. Oh, hey, we can't pass this up, chat. It's just chilling here, waiting for us to get it. Okay, the other day off of stream, I was trying to. Uh... I was trying to. Oh my god. To learn how to, um... <laughs> do, to, to, to use... How do you say her name? Uh, is it... Chen Yun or whatever? But I'm really bad at it, so... Yeah, at least right here I can use it. It helps a little bit. <laughs> but yeah. I'm not very good at using her. 
All right, but yeah, I have the cooties. Is it better or worse than the last one? It's definitely a little better. It just is lasting forever. Like it's not even enough to go to the doctor over and stuff. So yeah. Give me one second. <clears throat> Am I going for it? Hi, welcome. Yeah, her name is hard to say. I um, it's right there, but I kind of goof it up. <laughs> All of them? I mean, eventually I'll go. I'll go try to get them. But yeah. Um, hi. Did you get Nadia? I don't have. I don't have Nadia. No. I didn't. I only. I only pull, had enough to pull for for Shen Yun. I was sick today too. No, psychotic. You caught my cooties. No. <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> okay. Um. What were we working on? Oh wait. So it's the. This is okay. I'm trying to remember what we were doing. I know we were finishing the teapot stuff and everything. Let's do the daily. Let's do that. Let's do the dailies first. And then I also need to see... I got her last time we streamed it. On the poll, uh, we finished the Lee request and I got one of the the thingies like to, to, to in one wish <clears throat> and the wish was like literally what pulled her the single one <laughs> so i got her last time we streamed it mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> which is pretty silly yeah um okay give me one second actually let me have to remember where it is it's right here right i can ascend chevy really quick it's in you on it's you on but it would be you i wish she would just say her name out loud Anne. Because it's like Shin Jin Yuan 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 So it's like you say you and then the letter N Chien Yuan Like that Jin Yuan I was here for that bet No it's okay it's okay Nuggy don't worry How are you doing today Nuggy <laughs> Hi yeah, I got the burb lady. Did you get the burb lady, Angel? I am already forgetful. I think you did. Best single pull, yeah. Have you seen gaming idol animations at night? I bet it's really pretty because he's like, uh, he's so like colorful and glowy or whatever, right? Okay, we can ascend Chevy now. I just didn't have enough of those Thanks. fruit. With I don't know where they are. I'm not spending money for her. I didn't really now. spend much. It was mostly. It was mostly just like stuff I had saved up from pulling on the previous one. Oh, uh, I don't really want to level her up that much. <laughs> um, I don't want to use all my mats right now. We'll use like four, five. There we go. We'll do. We'll do one. <laughs> and we'll let's see. How many do I have to do to do one of these? There. Okay. She's level sixty-two now. All right, uh, back to what we were doing, my bad. I knew that, oh. Oh yeah, I want to, before we do that. <laughs> you guys, I need to make myself, I need to make myself like a fizzy or something. I'm like, God, my brain is just really out of it today. Mm. Yeah, slap my cheeks. 
wake myself up. <laughs> Have you? Uh, but uh, I bet he's really cute. I really like him. I know people weren't that excited for him, but I just think I'm not, like all about the aesthetic. So to me, I'm excited about it. So it's Jin Yuan. And yeah, I'll also just a reminder, tomorrow we're celebrating Lunar New Year together. We're going to be doing Donna Mandal wishes, which is super exciting. And also, if you guys would like to support the channel, um, we're going to be playing in a little bit uh, Star Trek uh, Fleet Command. And um, I'm really excited. We're sponsored by them. And so just by playing and hitting like level five, uh, getting your second ship or hitting level 10 all of those things support the channel so thank you so much for checking it out but we'll be playing in a little bit oh i forgot i wasn't i forgot i wasn't knob yeah i was just gonna coming at you fire well with rocks hands where i can see them stop don't waste my time I figured we should use some of our resin, right? <laughs> All right, now we can go do the dailies. Let's go do it, chat! Let's go! Um. Oh wait, his animation is different at night? Three pulls I had, yeah. To be honest, I'm scared for pulling right now and losing my 50-50. But if you, or did you not lose the last one? Just say if you lost the last one, then you're guaranteed, right? That's what chess says. Also, the Bruce Lee event is live now. Ah! What does it have? Does it just have all the... Is there a... Uh... We should always use... Re yeah, I had some and I was like, I'll go do more resin stuff later, but... I figure I should use some because it's full right now before he started. I lost the last one. Thanks. I'm sorry. All right. The Grandmaster took four. Sorry, I'm kind of skimming through the dailies. I want I want to go do some quests. I mean, is there an upcoming one? Do you want the bird mama so bad? Or like, if you miss the 50-50, there's the next one. Um, Where are we going? Okay. There we go. True tragedy was not getting... Sh I'm sorry, Chef is so fun. He's really fun. Okay. Let's go. To the lady. She has a lot of quests. Um, someone told me to bring you this letter. A letter for me? Godwin. I guess he must be okay. Yay! Read the letter to me. Um, the stone peaks in Leeway have it. Attracted the attention of many knights, but I am not a fan of them. Stone is roughened, uh, scratches the hands instead of like a kind a flower known as the silk flower. It has a fine texture and gives off a faint aroma. If I weren't so far away, I would bring some back to you. I bet you would love them. Oh, oh that's the end of the letter. He's so cute. Okay, she wants us to go talk to Godwin and tell him. She, that we're we're think he, she's thinking of him. You're, he's not even that far. He's literally like a hundred feet away. What a turd! <laughs> <laughs> All right. Na, 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 na. <laughs> okay. Godwin. She sent your best wishes. Uh, the star the cross lovers. I lost a lot. Yeah, I'm sorry, monkey. <laughs> the dandelions need to pick them myself. Next time you're more daily, I'll appreciate it. If you could help her out. 
All right. He gave us more dandelion seeds so we could give her more in the future. Okay, cool. We'll do this one. Where's Dory Clark? All right. There's an ad about to play, so if you end up getting an ad, I just want to say thank you so much for supporting the channel and watching them again. I'm sorry that I'm hey sick there. right now as well, and my voice is all raspy, but <laughs> thank you for watching and supporting the channel. I, I really appreciate it. Thanks for all the love and everything, guys. Okay, we have this daily. The dailies don't even take that much time, but I'm always, like, lazy about doing them. But if we get them done at the beginning of the stream, then we got them done. But yeah, let me know what's in the Bruce Lee event. We can go check it out in a little bit. I was assuming they're just unlocking it. Like, it's not like a big extra thing. They have so many events going on at the same time right now. It's kind of crazy. Arigato, thank you for head pat. Uh, and two new emotes? Okay, well, I'll have to go check it out. Yeah. Gotta make a video for it, you know? Hey the emotes are 800 gold? Ha. Hiya. A proper what the fart? From the Spina with love. Ha -ha. Uh, I was talking about Naraka, but there is a very large uh, Genshin, um... Uh, the, a new event happening soon. It's the, the big, uh, spring... Uh, event is happening in Genshin right now. So if you haven't logged in, that's what's going on right now. So it's like their biggest annual event. So technically, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Just the one that's already going on this last week. We were talking about Naraka. When is it? It's now. <laughs> it's already been happening. Um the this this event has it's already been happening for about a week yeah so uh since the last update was last wednesday or something yeah yeah cleaty yeah it's going on right now this is our biggest event of the year All right, we're almost there. Um, give me one second, chat. I need to try and blow my nose again. I'm sorry. All right. Oh, it's the slime one. Time to take out all the slimes. I'm coming for you. Boom! Hey there. Boom! Drop Boom. your weapons. I meant to shoot yeah. the other one. The auto aim kicking in, not to my favor. Watch Hi, out. gangster. I hope you're doing well. Yeah. All right. We did it! Whoop, whoop. I'm doing good. I still got a cold. But other than that, doing good, doing good. How are you? What you up to today? Do you have any fun plans for the weekend? Add Astra Happy Addison. Lunar New Year to you, too! Thank you for complete... We'll be celebrating it tomorrow. Add Astra... Um, we'll be celebrating it tomorrow, uh, and, uh, and Mickey wishes on Dada Manda, so that'll be really exciting. Everyone who had an ad, thank you so much for watching and supporting the channel. I super appreciate it. All right. Ta-da! Okay, we did them dailies, chat. We did them. We did them. We did them dailies. Boop, 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 boop. Okay. We got all that done. Now we can go back to our quests. <laughs> Thanks for your patience. Okay. Do, do, do. Mm. 
Which one were we doing? We were doing the teapot and then also the one in the leeway quest. When the trail goes full on recruiting adventurers for a new ambitious adventure. Oh yeah, no, no, no. These were the mountain ones. Right? Okay. And then upping our world level. That one's Fontaine. And then the teapot. And then... What is this one? You help investigate imbalances in local... Not that one. Where's the one where we were helping... Oh, we were helping the aftermath of of the jade chamber <laughs> i thought we were doing the jade i mean we'll we'll do this one too we'll do the teapot uh yeah you get an out for it for uh oh wait she i can't say that <laughs> You get an outfit too? I definitely will try my best uh to to uh to do to do to finish it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Sorry. I don't know what's wrong with me. I'm having a really bad brain fart today. Sleeping is my plan. Yay. You know what? That's the way you do it, man. That's the way. Good for you. We all need them sleepies. Honestly, I'm jealous because I I genuinely want way more sleep. So <laughs> Get a dollar on my doll on Discord. Don't forget to remind everyone, me Youth. Yeah, if you guys want to download, thank you. If you guys want to download it, it's it's in the Discord right now. If you guys go to the Discord, and if you go up near the top, there's at the like right here under updates, Lunar New Year wishes, and you guys can download the blank right here, and then fill in the I and everything. Tomorrow is super cute. If you guys would like to join. Us tomorrow for wishes and everything. Yeah. You can't beat the, atmosphere here. the unlimited tea. I wish I liked tea. That's what makes me so sad. I really wish I did. I, I really want to like tea. Hello, Mr. Crossell. How's business been? Oh, good. Very good. All thanks to your advice, Miss Yanfei. What brings you here today? You're too kind. I was simply your shorts my are job. cute. Now. I believe that the last time we met, you mentioned that you were looking to source some Smaragdus Jadeite to make hairpins. Have there been any further developments on this front? Uh, well, yes. As a matter of fact, uh, in the end, I did acquire a small piece of Smaragdus Jadeite and had it fashioned into a pair of hairpins. Miss Yanfei, might I presume that you have an interest in the hairpins? I must apologize. I have already rented them out to a lady named Zhe Xiao. If you'd like to inspect them, you may have to wait quite some time. Zhe Wait, Chow. isn't Smaragdus Jadeite really rare? Aren't you worried about the hairpins getting damaged or lost while they're being rented out? No, I'm not worried in the slightest, because I signed a contract with Miss Zhe Xiao before renting them to her. The contract makes it quite clear that if she loses or damages the item in question, she must compensate me for its full original value. Mm. In return, I included a clause that guarantees the Smaragdus Jadeite is genuine, with a penalty of ten times the item's value payable by me to Miss Zhi Chiao in the event that it is shown to be a fake. Oh, wow. Guaranteed genuine, with ten times the value payable if this claim is shown to be false. Yes, these terms are very clear indeed. Of course. This way, both the client and I have the assurance we need. To ensure fairness, each of us has retained an original copy of no, the contract. No, we're just telling Manny Man. Thanks for hanging case, out. Might you know where Miss Your Chow lives? We'd like to pay her a visit and have a look at the hairpins. Oh, of course. Give the high tree she wrote her How are you doing? Hi. Contract. Here, I'll mark it on your map for you. Thanks a lot, Mr. Crossell. We'll be off now. All right. Now we have to go to Zhu Chao. Is that how Zhu 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 Chao? It's so hard. I can't say the the. I I feel so bad that I can't pronounce the Chinese names. 
It's so difficult. Okay, but where? Do we go in here? Okay, yeah. Been working 11 hours a day on three hours. Oh my gosh! <sighs> I'm so sorry. Please, like, take care of yourself. It's so important. If you made reservations, I'll lead you to your seat. Are we not in the right location? I guess not. Oh, it's upstairs. Shoot. Uh, if you look at the event page, you said that you can see what characters you can unlock. Or wait. Maybe online or... Or is it on this thing? The special event. I'm actually really excited to play them. Okay, and then the rewards. Okay. It's like the compass. I know, but I haven't started the event. I haven't, I haven't, I haven't, you have to go to the quest. I did click it. I just haven't started it yet because I'm waiting because I want to finish leeway first. I'm sorry. How do I get up there? I'm so lost. How do I get up there? Back here? Where are the stairs? Oh, over here. So I will get confused. <laughs> It's okay, I got paid today and I'm getting a mic and an arm for the mic so I can start streaming and all. Yeah, let's go! I'm so proud of you! Guess this is where we go to buy books and Oh no! Feel free to look around. There's no, no I just wanted to, to pick up the sparklies! We're looking for the Leeway volume of the Tibet Travel Guide. Do you have it in stock? Sorry, dear. We stopped stocking that a very long time ago. It just wasn't selling. Huh? But the Mondstadt volume was so interesting. Bummer. The thing is, the author made it too personal, and the result wasn't really much of a guide. It barely sold any copies, and the few travelers that did buy it made complaints afterward. Too much passion, not enough well, clarity. It's a shame. The Mondstadt volume was a good read, even just as an adventurer's diary. The fact remains that I don't have it in stock. If you must read it, try your luck at Chang the Ninth's place. Who's Ching the Ninth? A book collector who lives in Qingse Village. He's a complete grouch. But he will behave himself if the conversation is about books. He was a regular customer here back when he lived in Liyue Harbor. And I still send him the odd out-of-print book or two every now and then. Did somebody say out-of-print books? Hey, yo! Is there a chance that Volume 6 of Legend of the Shattered Halberd is also in his collection? Um, Who are you? Apologies, my liege. Where are my manners? My name is Sing Cho, a humble literature enthusiast who happened Cho. to be passing by. Since you and I are both in search of lost books, what say we travel together to Mount Qingse and pay a visit to Chang the Ninth? Thank you for head pets! I listen while I work, and every time Paimon talks, I think it's Beezy. <laughs> My pleasure, fellow book lover. That's that's so that's so funny. I didn't mean to start this for the love of books. Should we ask here if they have a copy of the Leo volume of the Tevat Travel Guide? It's super duper interesting. I saw I saw the shinies, I saw the collectibles. I saw that there were books, and I was like, yo, I want it. I want it. Give me all the books. 
Give me all the books. Got distracted. Shaking my head. Okay, this is where we're going. Oh, whatever shall I do? Um, but hi everyone! How to say his name? There you go! Yeah! Uh, that's cute! He gets a new outfit! I had him in my first playthrough. Uh, thank you for the lurkies! Yes! Have fun with your lady! A real Hydro Archon. <laughs> Emergency rations. Lucicar, hello! Thanks for hanging out, everybody! I do share the same brain cell. Hi, Razor! Hello! Y yes, that's me. Is there something I can help you with? How do you do, Monsieur Chow? We understand from Mr. Crossel that you recently rented a pair of hairpins from him. I can't do it! Associates and I are very Hi, interested Mom, in them. Nice. <laughs> Would you mind letting us take a look at them? The hairpins? <sighs> I can't lend them to you right now. I... I've lost them. I don't know how it could have happened. I always kept them right by my side, and I hadn't even worn them yet. I spent so much money on them. If I have to pay their original value, th there's no way I could come up with that amount of money on such short notice. How did she lose them? Why did you need them in the I, first place? My family is in the ore business, too, but business has been suffering ever since the chasm was sealed off. We now have a backlog of paid-up orders just sitting around, so we've been having to purchase some stock from other ore merchants to complete them. A big banquet is coming up in a few days, and several ore merchants I know of will be there. I need this opportunity to mingle and discuss prices. That's what the hairpins were for, to... Oh, you thank you for the follow! Well, to keep up Welcome to the Pope's fun! I can't have them looking down on me. But now that I've lost the hairpins, what will I do? Ah... <sighs> Why does Paimon have a sudden strong sense of deja vu? Uh, maybe because this is part of where we say, We can help! Would you really? I sent a commission to we the Adventures help. Guild, but I haven't heard anything back from them yet. Hold on. Don't run off looking for the hairpins just yet. Mr. Chow, would you let me have a look at the rental contract you signed? Huh? Well, I mean, sure, I have it right here. Here you are. Let me see. Hmm. That's right! Yanfei said she's a legal advisor, didn't she? Maybe she can help Jichao somehow. Um, that would be a little unfair for True. Crystal. Though surely there must be a win-win solution. Right. I finished reading the contract. Yeah, we are the in this situation a lot. Clear, Hi, Dredge! How are do you doing? And they do indeed stipulate Hello? that you must pay Mr. Crossel the original Seems value of the hairpins as compensation for the loss. Furthermore, the contract also expressly states that the amount of compensation must take current market prices into account. And given the rarity of Smaragdus Jadeite, I fear that the final amount of compensation may end up being significantly higher as a result. Even higher? Oh, no. Uh-oh. Jicho looks like she's about to faint. However, all of this is assuming that it is indeed genuine Smaragdus Jadeite that was inlaid into the hairpins. Oh. Did you really have to pause before saying that part? But, like, anyway, why, would, he's, why would he so offer a fake product? Exactly would we be able to find out if the Jadeite is genuine or not? Whichever way you look at it, we've got to start by finding those hairpins. Except that if we found the hairpins, there'd no longer be any need to check whether the Jadeite is genuine, would there? Uh, seems right. Please. Please, I... Don't trouble yourselves over this. The fact is, I lost the item, and I should pay compensation per the contract. Mm, but can you afford it? Like, why did she even need to have such an expensive item to rent? Yeah, However it's a lot of money. I will have to pay it. My family are merchants, after all. It's vital that we keep our word and respect our contracts. Now that it's come to this, I really shouldn't keep Crossel in the dark any longer. I'll go and inform him of the issue, and then... negotiate the amount of compensation. Or we yes, could look for it. Speaking, Maybe it's, it like, this was is the stolen. Most course of action. But before that, I have some questions about the hairpins. 
So hold on a moment, Mr. Chow. When you first touched the hairpins, what did you feel? What did I feel? Well, I remember that the gemstones set into the pins were perfectly smooth to the touch, like the finest quality jade. My family has seen much jade pass through its hands in the past, so I am quite certain of my judgment in this matter. Hmm. Smooth <laughs> to the touch. Finest quality jade. Yeah, is it? What if it's fake? Yeah, like you guys said. Isn't it? Didn't they say that humans can't, like, touch the smeg no, it's nothing. The jade or whatever? I just need to re-examine a few things. Let's head over to Mr. Crossles. Is he a scammer? Is he a scammer then? Because, like, how did he? I don't know. It seems suspicious. Man seems sus. Sussy baka. All this for a teapot, chat. All this for a teapot. Ah, Miss Yanfei, you've returned. With Miss Jichao and Toe, too, I see. How are the hairpins? I trust you're quite satisfied with them? Hmm. About that. Oh. The poor babe. I feel so bad for but her. You lost them? Are you serious? Do you have any idea how expensive they were? Oh, no. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, Surely no. I, am. I feel so how bad for her. Has for contract, every last Mora. Mora? Huh. Do you have any idea what I had to go through to get my hands on that Smaragdus oh, jade? No. I, I just don't... <sighs> Forget it. Talking won't bring them back. Since Miss Yanfei is here, I suppose we can just have her estimate the amount that needs to be paid. No problem. But before I can give an official estimate, I'll need to do a little market research. Yeah, it does uh, kind of yes. seem like a scam. And I may just confirm again. It was, in fact, genuine Smaragdus Jade Eye inlaid into the hairpins, correct? Yeah, why did yeah, he have the fake claws? Genuine article guaranteed, or I pay back ten times the value. Why is that even in there? All right, understood. I'll conduct some market research, and once I'm back, I'll provide an official assessment of the sum owed by the Mr. Chow and compensation. The whole thing is just weird, honestly. Please wait here, Mr. Crossel. Thank you very much. <laughs> How could she lose my hairpins? She'd better pay every last mora that they're worth. He's kind of a grump butt, but also, I mean, if it's worth, like, millions of mora, then, like... Looks like I'll have to find some way to raise that money. Please wait, Mr. Chow. I have something to discuss with you. It's not convenient to speak here, so let's find somewhere that we can sit and talk in more detail. Yeah, yeah, he, is it he, you know, is he like have fake ones and then he accidentally gave her the fake one or intentionally gave her the fake one and then he's like trying to scam people out of money by then stealing it from them after? Or he realizes that after he's rented it out that it's actually fake, being really pompous, thinking it's real, and then it actually is fake and doesn't want to get caught, and that's why he's still... I don't know, it's weird. The whole thing is weird. It's a weird contract. Miss Yunfei, what is this about? Are you... Are you here to tell me how much I owe? Arara? No. Thanks for hanging out, everyone. I, I appreciate it. Is, there is a chance that the ore laid on those hairpins may not be Smaragdus Jadeite after all. Not Smaragdite? What? what do you mean? Yeah, because Are of the way she explained how it was to the touch. Sneak off and found them? Obviously not. I'm no adventurer, let alone a member of the guild. I don't run thankless, time-consuming errands for a living. Let's just say I made some deductions. I don't know if Granny told you this, but Smaragdus Jadeite is found deep underground and contains very concentrated elemental energy. Yeah, like, energy. people can't hold it, I if thought. If mortals come into contact with it, well, ah! they'll be sick in the best case. And in the worst case, they could even experience a dramatic change of personality. I told you, Chow! Most chat! certainly would not be smooth to the touch. Mr. Chow, did you at any time feel unwell while the hairpins were in your possession? No, not at all. I felt perfectly fine the whole time. They're fake! Not even fakey, 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 fakey! I didn't feel anything special at all, in fact. Hmm. Now that is strange. I noticed earlier that there were elemental traces in Mr. Crossel's vicinity. If I have deduced correctly, 
He may still have the Smaragdus Jadeite in his possession. What? If that's the case, we should go confront him right now and expose his dirty scam right to his face! That Absolutely dirty, nasty not. little turd! If we were to confront him now, there's no way he would admit to it. Eventually, he would find some argument to compel us to leave. And then, he'd throw the Smaragdus Jadeite into the sea the moment we were gone. After that, he would simply insist that Mr. Chow pay up per the contract. He would lose How nothing. are we gonna not? Meanwhile, like, how are we gonna catch him in this scam then? Every stone in Liyue, hoping and praying that the hairpins do actually still exist somewhere in this world. A very vivid it's description. So vivid that Paimon thinks it might be experience talking. Oh, it certainly is. I've seen my fair share of situations like this, and brute force methods are certainly one way of resolving them. Fortunately, I have far more elegant solutions at my disposal. I'll share them with you in due course. Thank well, you very well much. Then. Never mean me. Since you're so I know experienced that. in dealing with problems like this, perhaps you could help me, Miss Yunfei. Oh, that won't be a problem. Uh, it's but not me, first, thank you. Mr. Chow, can I ask you to please sign this contract? Huh? Does there have to be a contract for everything? Paimon can't even keep track. Yeah, <laughs> if I had one more, for every time I heard the word contract, yeah. He is even more concerned with them than a certain someone else we know. <laughs> These are my formal terms of engagement. Everything prior to now has just been pro bono advice. But for me to investigate any further, I require a written contract. Any work commissioned but not bound by a contract cannot be relied upon. I understand. Then I will be glad to place this matter into your capable hands if you will take it, Miss Yunfei. Ooh, no she, she wants, she wants some here. kickback if there's here. money to be made. Okay. I see how it is. Now write your address here and then sign on this page as well. In my head. And I'll also need your signatures on pages five, seven, and on the very last page. Oh Finally, my gosh. if you could just use this ink pad to make a handprint over here. Oh my gosh! This contract has so many pages. Paimon's all out of brain juice again. <laughs> Me too, Paimon. I'm out of brain juice too. All right, that should do it. it, it you're my right, it's the, the city of contract. And they're written in the contract. Have a look through and Everything let me know has if a price, it seems so. I've had a read through. Everything checks out. Well then, here's your copy of the contract. I will retain the other copy. And need no, me to do no, anything? No, no, Despite how intractable this problem might sound, it will actually be quite straightforward to resolve once we've got some things squared away. I don't believe you have been part of an investigation like this before. In which case, hopefully this should be quite the experience. Miss Yunfei, I have to ask, why are you helping me? Because, as it happens, I'm currently trying to acquire some Smaragdus Jadeite myself. I notice strong traces of geo-energy around Mr. Crossel, so perhaps he has, in fact, secured some. Whether he actually made it into an item of jewelry or not is a separate matter, but either way, it's a lead. As long as he follow it, <laughs> who knows? We either way, I'm gonna shake him down for it because I want the, the, the I also, need the, the, the it for Granny. Also, the someone abusing the law to their advantage, I won't stand for it. But again, let's not dwell on this. Let's go to... Hmm. Where can we find someone who processes ore? Ha! Ah, I've got it! Let's pay a visit to Chateau, the boss of the Jade Mystery. He's a professional when it comes to working with stone and ore. If Mr. Cross I guess that's true. She's all, uh, up front what she expects out of things. So choice. she's at least not scamming you in that sense. She means what she says and she says what she means. So, you know, at least you could take her at face value. <laughs> Another shady man over here. Why, hello there, honored customers. Welcome to. Th oh, it, it, it's you, Miss Yenfei. Is 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 something the matter? If I had a nickel for every time Surely I do something nice and I get screwed over, that, so I mean, fair enough, fair enough. I understand why no they have so many contracts. <laughs> oh, I swear on all that is sacred. No, nothing of the sort. Has a Snesh 9 merchant named Crossel enlisted your ore processing services recently by any chance? A Snesh 9 merchant named Crossel, you say? Hmm, I do remember that. He brought me a piece of ore, claiming that it was Smaragdus Jadeite. 
That was the first time I'd ever encountered it, so I had no way of telling if it was really Smaragdus Jadeite or not. But if a customer insists, far be it from me to contradict them. He was quite generous with his money, too, so I didn't give it too much thought. I processed the ore as per his request. Hmm. Do you have any leftover debris from your work on it? Uh, why, yes. It was my first time encountering this ore, after all, so I kept a few loose shavings to study myself later. Those are not They're loose right shavings. There, Those are fact. huge. Thank you, sir. We'll take a look at them. Those are not just, like, freaking tiny little little shaveroonies, okay? Those are chonks. Those are pretty decent chonks. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> shavings my butt cheek. Huh? If my eyes don't deceive me, the cross-sections and patterning suggest that these are Smaragdus nephrite shavings. Mm. Oh yeah, her family does ore, so she could tell. Yes. It's nephrite, it's not, it's not rare, Jedi! Nor is it especially valuable. It's used to make jewelry all the time. I've heard it said that Smaragdus nephrite is in fact the outer layer of Smaragdus jadeite, though no one's ever proven it. A thin layer of separation, huh? I mean, uh, fun facts with me too. If you must for yourself, try examining these shavings for traces of elemental energy. Smaragdus nephrite is an entirely ordinary ore containing no elemental energy whatsoever. Fun facts with me and Sue, uh, jadeite and nephrite were originally both called jade and are commonly both called jade to this day, but then there's like a cross up of like if it's jade, if it's not, whatever. There are actually two different minerals. They were both called jade back in the day because they were so similar, but they're actually minerally different. Like you look under a microscope, they're actually like differently like crystallized forms and stuff, but still commonly like both used in uh, making carvings of, of jade and stuff. But of course, jadeite is considered the actual jade and nephrite is considered the, the you know, nephrite, a kind of jade. <laughs> and there's different kinds of jade throughout the world in different purities and different whatever. But what's really interesting about it is like most of the nephrite actually doesn't come like for in like Burma is where a lot of the great uh, jade and stuff comes out of, which actually isn't in... China. So, like, the most of what comes out of China, I don't even think you can get jadeite out of China. It's just nephrite um, and everything, which is really, really interesting. So, well, we might as well give Elemental Scythe a shot. So, did you find anything? Not a trace. So they really are different. But wait, how come Jicho was able to tell what it was just by looking at the shards? That's pretty awesome. There's nothing special to it. It just so happens that I've come across a great many of these in my time. Why couldn't Chateau tell? These two stones actually look very similar. Someone without a deep understanding of them would find it very difficult to tell them apart. There Yo. Be a subtle difference for the casual viewer, but that translates to an astronomical difference in terms of the market price. And, I'm sure, a significant difference in the cost of having them carved into shape. Uh, yo, Malik, thank you so very much for the subby. Thank you. Arigato. Thank you. And hi, Secret. How have you been? Hello. Thanks for coming and hanging out. All right. Let's focus up. We're going off on a tangent. But never mind, Shirto. Why would Mr. Crossel... <sighs> unusual actions have unusual reasons behind them. Let's take some of these shavings back to Chateau. <laughs> Sorry, thank you so much for the the sub. I appreciate it. And they were so they, apparently they were the Chinese were so advanced in a lot of different ways. Their technology is compared to all the time. That's so crazy, actually. I mean, they did during their like bronze era as well. Honestly, they did like a lot of wild stuff, and technology was being I went too far was being developed and everything, which is kind of cray cray. Or wait, what? Where is he? Oh my god. I went the wrong <laughs> Oh no, I triggered it! I, I triggered we had something! An Loser buys dim sum tomorrow? <laughs> Look at you. Scowl like that for much longer and your face might stay that way. So cute! Hey now, don't be upset. How about this? You extend the invitation and I'll pay. Uh, no way, Gaming. You're always the one picking up the tab. I'm not trying to be a sore loser. I just didn't expect you to come from behind a win like that. <laughs> that was nothing. I like All his voice actor. Work, friend. 
Perfect. Gaming is here. Sorry to interrupt, Gaming. We just spoke to a guy from the communications office who needs you to deliver some goods to Elon Wharf. Oh, that must have been Longjo. Looks like I've got work. Gotta go. Sure, go do your thing. Uh, let's have a rematch when you get back. I won't let you win so easily next time. <laughs> Alrighty, you can hand the goods over to me. Must have been heavy hauling them all this way. Let me take them off your hands. I love his voice actor! It wasn't that bad. It's just some kite-making materials. Plus, we didn't have to walk very far. Kite-making materials. I see, I see. I'm glad it wasn't too much trouble, Paimon. Still, I owe you one. Ah, and you must be the traveler. It's nice to meet you. Thanks for your help. Huh? You know us? Yeah, he just knows who, who we are, <laughs> there yeah. There probably aren't many in Liyue who don't. I've heard quite a bit the about you secret. two. secret! You're quite well known around these parts. Oh, and please excuse Longzhou if he forgot to thank you. Uh, take my thanks in his place. He's a good guy. He's just been super busy lately. No Running around necessary. from place to place. Don't be too hard on him, yeah? So, you here for Lantern, right? Yep. It's always so lively this time of year. We were actually hoping we could tag along to Elon Wharf and have a look around. Perfect. We'll go together then. I'm good with directions, so just follow me. Trust me, I know my way around. We can exchange stories, tell jokes, or just chat along the way. Oh, and there are a couple of good places to eat along our route. We can stop and grab a bite when it's time. The ingredients are fresh, the portions are generous, and the prices won't break the bank. You can order anything, and I promise, you won't be disappointed. Order anything? Paimon seems to be drooling already. Paimon out like that in front of our new friend? Don't worry, I understand. I joke around like that with my friends, too. Aww. It just shows how close you are. You He's need so to pack cute. anything up before you hit the road? Him. I can wait. Nope, our things are always packed and ready. We're pretty much travel experts at this point. Oh, that's right. Then let's get going. If you run into any trouble, you can count on me to protect you. I am a guard, after all. Ah, that's how it starts. There you go. <laughs> wow, it's so pretty! Ah! It's so cute! Okay, paper, shadows, a foraging. Joyful beasts and their auspicious. And not yet unlocked. Complete. Ah, there's a Now I want to do it! Look you! Ah! Okay, let's finish this. Sorry. <laughs> can you release like, your friends if you can't talk like, crap about each other? Maybe, maybe not. I guess it depends the kind of friendship you have with that person. <laughs> yeah, Paimon, they're just best buddies already, honestly. Ooh, ah. Ah. Miss Yenfei, might I be so bold as yes, to inquire? Um, if you could just confirm for me once more, sir, Mr. Crossell did indeed claim that the ore he brought to your store was in fact Smaragdus Jadeite, did he not? Uh, yes, that's right. I still have a record of the job with me, in fact. Um, here, it says quite clearly, one chunk Smaragdus Jadeite, uncut. Then I have no further questions. But could I borrow the processing record and these stone shavings? Of course. Hi, but Skittles. might I ask why you need them? Welcome, welcome. Oh, I have my reasons. Ah, yes. Please sign here on this affidavit. This document shall serve as signed proof that these stone shavings originated from the, uh, ore that Mr. Crossell brought to your store. Please read it carefully. Hmm, yes. I see. I see. <laughs> Forgive me for asking again, Miss Yanfei, but might I know the nature of the incident on this occasion? I wouldn't say there's been an incident, just a minor issue. Thank you, sir. I'll take these with me. With this hard evidence to back us up, Crusoe won't dare try to deny what he did! <laughs> on the contrary, this is far from sufficient to build a case. We need to find something a little more compelling. 
If you want to make jewelry, you need a professional jewelsmith. Let me think. Jewelry. She's got jewelry. such a big book. Mm -hmm. Nope. Of clients. Aha! Got it. Sinksy. She often helps people to find a jewelsmith. Let's go pay her a visit. Maybe she well, knows quick. the tea. How can you know so many people? Because lots of people come to me for legal advice every day. As you know, Liyue Harbor is the city of contracts. And contracts, well, I should say laws, are very important to us. But the amendments made by the Tianchuan to our laws are unnecessarily complicated. How can I put this? It just seems like they're hard to understand and impossible to finish. As such, legal advisors like myself provide quite the popular service indeed. So you help them make sense of the law. But didn't you say that it's hard to understand and impossible to finish? Yes, well, that's no obstacle because I've memorized all the legal codices. You memorized them? <laughs> you sound surprised. Knowing the law inside out is a legal advisor's bread and butter, you know? Is this how the adept I became so adept at oh, everything? This has nothing to do with being an adeptus. I just like reading things. Again, with that casual tone. Well, that's that then. Let's go look for Sinksy. Um, yeah, it's kind of expensive. Sometimes you can get it on sale for 200. Uh, I've, I, I can tell you what I went through. I actually have clips of different mics I went through. Uh, Nerva and I both have this mic and I did get it replaced by them. I had an issue with my first one and they replaced it even though it was out of uh, warranty. And, um, but yeah, this is the, the beacon mic and it, what it's, what's nice about it is it has, it's like, it, it has like all the XLR crap inside of it. So you don't need a mixer or whatever. What are they called there? Yeah, you don't need an audio interface. So like most of the streamers, the most common mic that everybody uses is this, which is the Shure SM7B, which is not even a new mic. There's way better stuff out there. I don't know why this is the go-to, but it is. And it's $400 and it's never gone down in price. And honestly, by now it's like so old. And then you also need an audio interface to even use it. So um, I ended up going with this mic. So this is the one I have. I have a black one right now. I used to have a white one. Um, and I like it a lot. And the reason I chose it is because I cannot like out blow it. It has like uh, this like so mics are capable of only like inputting so much like noise and it's impossible to like out screens. like scream into the mic and like blow it out by decibels you know it's like it's something something float which flow is it what should i try this time <laughs> no, yes it has 32-bit float i don't really know a lot about audio stuff but uh they're really nice they give me a plushie when i was at Twi uh, twitchcon <laughs> But yeah, if you guys are looking for a mic for as a new content creator, uh, the, the this is what I would do. So I before this had this um, Sam, how what is Sam Sun mic? How do you spell it? This thing Samson. It's a yeah okay. The Sam so I had the Samson G Track Pro USB mic before this, and I think this is way better than the the Blue Yeti. Um, so personally, in the budgets, the for me, I my my knowledge might be a bit outdated, but if you want the cheap mics, go for the Snowball, the Snowball bike for forty dollars. This one. Go for this for the super budget mic. Uh, above that, go for the Samson G Track Pro. Again, my my data might be. I personally think it's better than um, than the Blue Yeti, and it's priced very similarly. And honestly, the mic is better. The only downside of it is it's really heavy. And you sh will have to, if you want to put it on an arm, you have to get an arm that can hold it, and it's really heavy. 
Um, and then, uh, yeah, and then the next up would be an XLR mic, which, of course, the reason I chose the Beacon mic is because uh, of its built-in, all the stuff, the audio, digital interface, as well as the f mostly the fact that I don't need an audio, like, like I don't need an audio interface and so like, as a third thing to make it more expensive, and I can't blast it out with my vocal range. But also, you should just go online and listen to other people trying out mics because some mics are better for some people's voices than others. Some are more better for like male voices or female investment. voices or more whatever. So, um, yeah, that's what I would do. <laughs> I hope that helps, QS. I don't know if that if you care, but like. But also, hi Nimbo, how are you doing? Your absolute grind I did for this game. Yo, do you play it a lot? I also recommend, yeah, do you like your HyperX quadcast? I know a lot of creators have those and like it a lot. Oh, what should I try this time? But that's just, uh, that's just for me what, uh, what I prefer and for my voice of, uh, like, again, uh, definitely go find someone <laughs> online testing the mic who has a voice that you think is a similar range and tonality to you um because at the end of the day there's like a like i've heard some and then also you have to ask yourself like how knowledgeable are you about audio because uh there's plenty of mics that, like eddie you can make a mic that like is like a potato that's twenty dollars like like a $20 mic sound amazing but out of the box it sounds like a potato right you can make any mic sound good and any mic sound bad and you can have a cheap mic sound way better than an expensive mic but some come out of the box sounding a lot better than others and you're gonna have to have the knowledge to be able to make it sound good for you so also keep that in mind when you're shopping for mics uh fyi <laughs> yeah I need to just have a list with a bunch of like referral links for products I like because you, yeah, if you, I have like pro, like every product ever. So if you, I even have every size of Stream Deck and I don't even use them very much. So I've went through all the phases of streaming. So if you, I've been around for five years. So if you guys have any questions, I try my best to answer. But I hope you're doing well, Nimpo. AR58, let's go. You've been on the grind. Yeah, the SM7B now, but uh, I use the SM7B, but yeah, for like two or three years. I feel like that the thing with the SM7B is like outdated now. Like if if you were today, where I would look at what's new and coming out and like shop price around because like for me, the reason I chose the Beacon Mic is because I didn't need an audio f interface. It had the same. I'm at, like parts and quality to the SM7B and it was cheaper. Uh, 270 instead of instead of 400 and then the no audio interface which you know 100 to 200 dollars so like 600 dollars versus 300 dollars is like half price. Um but again like you got to find like what's good for you. Everyone uses the SM7B. So if you want something reliable and you're like yeah, then you get that. But um I've heard there's a bunch of new mics that just came out recently that are way better. But again, I haven't been on the market, so I can't speak for like the last year and a half. Um, I've had my mic for two and a half years and actually mine was out of the tier warranty and had an issue um, and I just hadn't addressed it. And they sent me a whole brand new mic for free trade war, out of warranty um no the the beacon people are really nice and the little hands-on help you fix your audio in their discord server um and they're they have a really nice like interface i still have a little bit of issues with it i'll be honest with you sometimes like the program is a little goofy and i'm gonna be honest i've been a really lazy content creator and haven't sat down and fixed it um and i also have the mixer and nerva has the mixer now too and he freaking loves it so uh Overall, I love the product. I think it's great. Love would love to be a content creator for them. I think that they're a great company. And for me, the biggest we thing is the fact that I can go ah! and like, you know, things. like I don't blow my mics out because every other mic that I've ever had, I can blow out. This one, even a concert can't blow it out. So, and it's a USB, so it's really convenient. I'm not even sponsored by them. I don't, so, <laughs> you see, 
but that's just me. What should I try? Again, choose what sounds good for you. This sounds good with my female voice. So, and I can go super low and then super high. Like, so. Um, and I do have my settings a little farted up right now. Even they need to be fixed. Uh, it actually sounded better before, and I swapped my mics, and I fiddled with it time. when Nerva was gone one time over Christmas break, and I messed it up, and I haven't fixed it since. So, yeah. <laughs> but, yeah, feel free to ask. Um, if you guys are in my Discord, um, I think we have a tech help section still. Do we still have that? Yeah, if you guys have any, like, questions... For, for tech help, is it under et cetera? Yeah. If you guys have any questions or you want to like know some information, um, especially about like streaming questions, like feel free to ask me and in my like time, I will try my best to answer. I am not by any means a perfect content creator or super knowledgeable about tech, but between all of us nerds, we'll try our best to help you. But yeah. Yeah, Nerva is more of the audio file than me. Yeah, that's true. They did they they have a new plugin, right? We actually talked to the people at uh the Steam Deck people, right? Aren't they owned by Elgato? Yeah, we talked to them and when we were at you uh when we were at TwitchCon and they were so cool because they are like talking about their this like this new marketplace thing that they have going on and trying to cross over and making plugins and assets and all these things that like for content creators like in one spot and offering like so much knowledge and creativity. So it was really exciting because so uh when I became a VTuber, my stream deck became obsolete for me. Because we program this, right? So I have this whole entire program that does all these things and I have buttons to do it, right? But it's so if I'm clicked into game, I'll show you to set it up. If, if I click kiss, what? It didn't do it that time. Did you already fix it? Oh, there it was. There it was. You guys saw it. Did you see my VTuber zoom in? So what happened? What happened? You didn't really see it in Genshin. But <laughs> see you later, QS. No worries. Have a great rest of your day. Um, but what happens is it toggles between which program it's using. So even though I trigger it, um, it has to still tab out a game. So at that point, it's like, why don't I just tab out and click it? Like, y you know what I mean? It's not that much faster and convenient to like grab it and do it but uh there's a new plugin for uh with unity and it um so uh now it should be streamlined and not affect each other so i'm really excited for that yeah i already had a go xlr beforehand ah uh, then if you already have a go xlr you probably just wanted an xlr mic anyway so that just makes sense because that's another thing though if you have an xlr or some sort of mixer that needs an xlr this mic doesn't work with it and it's a pain to set up a usb mic with the mixers that use those so you 100 percent. we went down that rabbit hole because we were looking at the go xlr at the time and then i also still had a usb mic and then i was like oh, what am i gonna do and then even my headphones are usb do i need to swap something like it was a even whole if thing an antique is priceless the happiness it brings lasts for only the moment. But yeah, it's nothing wrong. It's still really great. There, but there's more competitors that are coming out nowadays that are cheaper. That's all. That's all. No shade to the to the SM. Wallace, hi. How are you doing? Hi, Orgami. How are you doing? Thanks for hanging out. Yeah, I love the mixer. I mute and unmute and adjust volume and apps like crazy. I usually have a game, a show, a stream, and some 3D projects. So I'm messing with audio all the time. So yeah, he loves it. Okay, we're gonna continue this quest. I'm so sorry. I'm like dawdling around today. I gotta pee. We should look for a new investment. Mora doesn't grow on trees. Try 
look, betting on Jade? I can't believe it. I hope you'll be able to find the kite of your dreams. Betting on Jade? In a trade war, the perfect hunter leaves no trace. Okay, I'm back. Sorry. Enjoy your judgmental AFK face. It's just like whatever face it last catches, it seems to do. <laughs> Wanna know where, where you go? Oh, shoot. I'm sorry. I read that and I forgot to tell you. I read it and I forgot. So I actually, d you can get a creator code from these guys too. And I for have it. It's Zenny. Why is their link so hideous on their front page? Uh, we should look for a new the fort. Mora okay, use this on one. Trees. I don't know why it's wrong with that one. This is where I got it. Roddy is originally who showed me. And they have a uh, frame starting at 695, and that includes the lens. Like a plain lens. But uh, I have their my they have blue light blocking um, my, uh, glasses, but I like their I prefer their migraine glasses. I have blue light blockers too, uh, just on all of my normal clear glasses. But I use these when I have migraines, and they help a lot. Nerva can contest because he literally stole mine. Um, I started out with this pair, and they're great. Uh, but these ones are super, super, super dark, and I love them but they are extra dark. So they're less versatile, but like uh, I thought that maybe I was worried even these would be too dark. They're definitely not inside outside totally easily. This one, honestly, inside outside too even with lights on, you get used priceless. to it. So it's just the a few. They're a bit expensive on the migraine glasses, unfortunately, specifically. But other than that, okay, let's continue. Oh, Miss Yenfei, it's you. Has something happened? Did the client <laughs> from last time uh... have no further trouble from then on? Yes, of course. I'm just here to ask you a few questions. <laughs> Everyone sees her and gets scared. Does the name of Crossel ask you to put him in contact with a jewelsmith recently? Crossel. Sorry, chat. Yes, I remember him. He's a merchant from Snezhnaya, no? Yeah, he came to me with a chunk of something he called Smaragdus Jadeite. The design of the hairpins that he gave me was quite intricate, so it took me some work to find someone who was up to the job. Eventually, I found an older jewelsmith oh, who made them exactly thanks, according thank you so much to his the specifications. Welcome to the Poop Squad. I think I this missed it before I walked away. Thank you. Time, and only completed quite recently, which is why I remember it so well. Doesn't seem like there's any evidence to be found here. Miss Inksy, I'd like for you to confirm for me once more. When Mr. Crossell commissioned you to find him a jewelsmith, did he or did he not assert that the material he presented to you that day was called Smaragdus Jadeite? Yes, I'm sure of it. The hairpins were made using many expensive materials, and the asking price was quite high, so we had to put this transaction on record with the Ministry of Civil Affairs. Oh, T. Mr. Crossell wasn't very familiar with the necessary procedures, so I filed it on his behalf. I also kept a copy for my own records. See for yourself. The item is called Smaragdus Jadeite Twin Phoenix Pins. 
the inlaid gemstone is recorded as Smaragdus Jadeite. The document even has the official seal of the ministry on it. But who, like, verified you, that Cincy. it's real? Now, could you let me borrow this document? Sure. It isn't serving much purpose here anyway. I take it, then, that there's been some more trouble? Nothing you need to worry about. Just a minor issue. I'll return your document as soon as I'm done with it. Thanks again. Why is everyone's Thank you everyone first reaction out, by the way. always to assume someone you. or something is in trouble? Um, uh, must be the nature of League hmm. Rules. <laughs> I believe we have yeah. almost all the evidence we need. We just need to make one last trip. Let's go to Boo Boo Pharmacy to speak with Dr. Baizu. Boo Boo! To the Boo Boo! Let's do it! Baizu? A weirdo with the snake around his head? <laughs> what do you want to speak to him for? She's like because spirit animal. <laughs> he can provide an authoritative statement confirming that Smaragdus Jadeite is harmful to the human body. Once we have this final piece of evidence in our hands, we can wrap this case up. All right. The Boo Boo Pharmacy away. Uh, Yo, she getting all the stuff. She is, uh, she is ready to rock and roll. <laughs> oh, thanks Angel for thanking the person for the volley to you. Uh, of course, this is when I go AFK, I walk away, I pop my headphones out. Every time. <laughs> All right. Yo, Baizu, talk about it. My, my. To what do I owe the pleasure? Though I'm afraid that if you're looking for our little Chi-Chi, she's out gathering herbs. And if it isn't it's Miss Yenfei herbs. as well. Now that's an even rarer honor. What business brings you here, might I inquire? Some charlatans peddling ineffectual medicines again, no doubt? <laughs> no, no. I'm here this time to ask if you're familiar with Smaragdus Jadeite. Hopefully. Smaragdus Jadeite? Why, yes, there is some information Why, yes? about it included in the sixth commentary on the Seven Mountain Treatises. The Seven Mountain Treatises states that this substance springs forth from stone marrow within the mountains and will bring disaster to any mere mortals who touch it. Mere mortals. It is abundant in elemental energy, so if someone without a vision is in contact with it for a prolonged period, best case scenario, they fall ill. Worst case scenario, they'll suffer great changes in personality and their illness will only ever get worse. He's anyway, uh, like I'm quoting sure you her. Come all this way just to chit chat. Knowing you, Yenfei, and given the specific nature of your question, I suppose that you're about to ask me to write an official affidavit attesting to the pharmaceutical peculiarities of Smaragdus Jadeite. <laughs> that is indeed the case. A spot on. Would be so kind, Doctor Baiju. No trouble at all. It's just a single document. Won't take me a moment. I would mention, though, that you are not the only one who's developed a curiosity for Smaragdus Jadeite. Okay, T. A Snezhnayan merchant oh. came to ask me about it not long ago. But after I gave him my reply, his expression shifted to one of remarkable disappointment. Oh, no, it was him, and he found out it would make people sick. I wonder, Miss Yenfei, if your pressing business might be related to the Snezhnayan merchant? You have, uh, you are you incredibly wise, sir. That, Dr. Baizu. Thank you for penning us that document. I'll make sure to compensate you in due course. You're too kind. Take care now. Take care now. Dude, I want more lore on him. He's interesting and fun. <laughs> He's very fun. That Baizu guy is as weird as ever. <laughs> Buys you guys as weird as ever. For something back there. He's as weird as ever. Like well, thank we you have guys for watching the need. ads and supporting Let's the go channel. Find Mr. Crossel. I really appreciate it. He's as weird as ever. I buys you guy. <laughs> All right, Croxel. the jig's up. Miss Yanfei, have we you finished know what your you investigation? Did. I trust you will now be in a position to assess the compensation due. Yes. My investigation is indeed concluded. I can now provide a final figure for the amount payable. Wonderful. Well then, please, could you do the honors, Miss Yanfei? <laughs> She's gonna say he owes her money. Of course. Ahem. <clears throat> According to the stipulations of the contract, Mr. Crossel, you must pay Mr. Chow ten times the original transaction price. <laughs> 
Sure. Wait, what? <laughs> Me pay her? Surely there's been some kind of mistake, Miss Yanfei. He knows. He knows he did something Not bad. At all. According to my investigations and the material evidence that we've gathered, the substance claimed to be Smaragdus Jadeite that was inlaid within the Smaragdus Jadeite twin Phoenix pins that you rented out to Mr. Chow was, in fact, Smaragdus Nephrite. Now, the contract states very clearly that ten <laughs> times the price shall be paid she got should him the so article good. not be genuine. Accordingly, you are liable for this sum, which is payable to Mr. Chow in Mora. Material evidence? What material evidence? Why, Miss Yanfei, you cannot frame me like this. I spent a huge sum to obtain that Sparagdus Jadeite, and yet you claim that the ore inlaid on the hairpins is somehow fake? I don't think I so, sir. You evidence. know what you did. Indeed. Only a testimony from an expert witness involved in the processing of the ore can serve as an authoritative assessment of whether it is genuine. Traveler, please produce the evidence in question. Uh, show the evidence of the jade, show the evidence of the jewelry. Uh, yeah, the jade. This is a processing record from the jade mystery, along mm -hmm, with stone mm -hmm, samples mm -hmm. and an affidavit signed by the business owner, Chateau. Seriously? We got you good, Even the boss dude. there couldn't differentiate between Smaragdus Jadeite and Smaragdus Nephrite. How does this prove anything? In any case, Smaragdus Nephrite is the outer layer of Smaragdus Jadeite. So I had him cut away the nephrite. He returned the valuable jadeite core to me. There and wouldn't some be nephrite any shavings in the left over from the. What am I missing mm -hmm. exactly? Th that's an unsubstantiated belief. Well, your claim that my ore is fake is just as unsubstantiated. Mm -mm. And we are here to talk about evidence, aren't we? He's a little turd. Ugh. Looks like our first piece of evidence didn't convince him at all. No, nah, we have more. Seems we like have a lot more. Prepared. Don't worry, it goes next? on. Hard evidence, something legally binding. We have just the thing. Show him, <laughs> traveler. Um, oh, here is the uh, the thing from the jewelry. Huh. This document proves that my hairpins are the real deal, doesn't it? No. This is the ministry's seal, after all. It shows that the ore inlaid on the pins is indeed Smaragdus Jadeite. Does it? Our second piece of evidence didn't work either. I don't and think so. We're putting it together, sir. Hmm. You know, you could be right. Perhaps the hairpins are she's, the real deal after all. She is totally of late. I'm like, right. she's all leading him on. She's got story. him cornered. He doesn't realize, well, though. Well, hang on a moment now, because I do recall one final piece of evidence that we haven't revealed yet. Traveler, would you do the honors? The pharmacy. What's this? Smaragdus Jadeite springs forth from Stone Marrow within the mountains and will bring disaster to any mere mortals who touch it. Sustained you contact talent. with Smaragdus Jadeite over a prolonged period will, in less serious cases, cause a mild malady, while in serious cases, the patient may suffer a dramatic change of personality and fall seriously ill. Mr. Crossell, were you what? aware of these peculiar properties of Smaragdus Jadeite? Wouldn't it be I, incredibly I uh, no negligent idea. for you to sell a product that would make people no sick? No idea, you say? Hmm, I'd guessed as much. But for you to have rented out such a dangerous item... Yeah! <laughs> I'm afraid that this falls outside the scope of my work, but within that of the Ministry of Civil Affairs. However, I'm sure that the Ministry will be relatively lenient, considering that, as you say, you were ignorant of the danger you posed. Or Don't worry, were you? Castle, I will make sure that all the evidence presented here will be handed over to the Ministry. I trust that you'll give them your full cooperation in their investigations. What? Wait, wait! I... I knew. He is really smog oh, right there, so yeah. You knew? Oh, dear, Mr. Crossell. But if you knew of Smaragdus Jadeite's dangerous properties beforehand, why, then would, why you... would you. Why would you huh? rent it out? No, that seems so I... horrible. <sighs> the hairpins aren't actually. Aren't actually inlaid with genuine Smaragdus Jadeite? Is that what you were about to say? <laughs> you do understand, Mr. Crossell, that this means that you will have to pay Ms. Sir Chow ten times the original price in Mora? Mr. Crossell, your answer, please. <laughs> My client and I are waiting. I... 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 Yampi's seriously intimidating right now. It's like she's a different person. The legal consultancy for you. Uh, yeah, jeez. I, I confess. He Your got it good. I laid on those hairpins was, was Smaragdus Nephrite. B but I'm a victim in all of this too. 
I invested a great deal of time and money into acquiring that small amount of sparagnus jadeite. Why didn't you research in the hopes of it sparagnus into a piece of first? jewelry that would fetch a fine price? But after receiving it and carrying it around for a few days, I started to feel extreme discomfort. Mm. I couldn't sleep a wink or eat a single bite. I, I was in a constant state of agitation too. I went to Boo Boo Pharmacy to get myself checked out, only to discover that this sort of stone cannot be worn as jewelry. But how could I let all that money go to waste? Why didn't you do That's better research when you were procuring it? You ding dong! Which is almost indistinguishable from Smaragdus Jadeite. I kept the real Smaragdus Jadeite in a specially made box. I daren't touch it again. I was worried sell that it to us. See we it, want it. Which is why I only dared to rent them out, not sell them. And then to top it all off, Ji Chao lost the hairpins after I rented them out to her. So why did you charge? That was such an extraordinary for rental price. Exactly. Yeah. If they weren't the real deal, why'd you make her pay so much? Hmm? Shaking my I, head. I didn't want to either. But when I purchased that Smaragdus Jadeite, some of my business partners found out. I knew they'd be watching closely to see how much I could make off it. If word got out that I sold a pair of fake hairpins, then my days in this line of business would be over. All right. I think he stole Let's it, still. the appeals phase right there. But then who stole it if it wasn't him? I don't know. has on your transaction with my client. According to the contract, you must pay Mr. Chow ten times the original price in Mora, and that is final. Ten... ten times? Yeah, why did you put that in the contract, you dumb-dumb? Oh man. As for me, according to my contract with Mr. Chow, 20% of that sum will go to me. 20%? <laughs> That's as much as I spent on that Smaragdus Jadeite. Um, there's no need. It's fine. You don't have to pay me that much, Mora. Even if the Smaragdus Jadeite on those hairpins was fake, I still bear responsibility for losing them. Legally or not, I think I owe some compensation for that. Uh, Ms. Jichel. She is too nice! You... However, Mr. Crossel, since you have no use for that chunk of Smaragdus Jadeite, why don't you give it to me instead? I'll consider us even. Oh, she what? knows we need it. But I... Bless her! All right, then. This cursed rock's brought me enough grief as it is. Yeah, just get rid of it, man. Give it to me. I want it. Ms. I need Yenfei. it. I'll turn this Maragdus Jadeite over to you. I trust that it will suffice as remuneration? Well, um, that's not quite how the rules say this should go. But whatever. It'll oh, do. little hollow! Thank Thanks you so, so much! Thanks so much for your help this time, Ms. Thank Yenfei. you for the subby! It's when been good! Time, how are you? Sure Thank you for the love! Thank you for the more appropriately. Oh, come on. No need to stand on ceremony. Now, if I may confirm this again, Mr. Chow, have you and Mr. Genshin's Crossel come to an understanding? How are you and hi, Topper? Hmm? Well, yes, I believe we have. Well then, that's good. Mr. Crossel, it seems that my client has no further claims against you. Is... is that so? Is it over? That's good. That's good. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Actually, Mr. Crossel, I'd like to talk business for a second, if I may. Well, where did I the hairpins the hair go? You Oops, like, where did she lose them? Design. That's... My family, on the other hand, works in the ore business, and we have a fair stock of fine ores. If we could join forces, your jewelry designs and our choice ores, I think we could do some fine business between us. Ah, they're friends! I, uh, let me think for a moment. Well, that's that. All's and well that ends well, I suppose. Granny wants too. All's well that ends well, eh? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so there were some twists and turns along exactly. the way. She literally said Usually it. Usually when someone tells us they've lost something, we end up searching all over the place for it. But this time, you managed to solve the problem with just a big stack of documents. Yeah, she didn't even have to find <laughs> it. She's a lot more efficient than we are. Actually finding the hairpins. The right solution depends on your perspective on the problem. The objective of my client, Mr. Chow, was to reduce her liability to pay compensation. So, rather than looking high and low for some hairpins, proving that the rented item was nowhere near worth what the vendor had claimed it to be was the more efficient solution. Fair enough. Can't say I ever met an adept I like an you adeptus. before. Speaking of, you took part in that battle, didn't you? In which case, you would have heard what Granny said. 
Liyue Harbor is now a city ruled by humans. The title of Adeptus means precious little to me compared to my job as a legal advisor. Aww. In any case, don't you think that the Liyue so Harbor noble, today honestly. needs legal consultancy far more than it needs adeptal powers? Paimon can think of someone who True. would definitely disagree with your reasoning. I mean, to be fair, though, she kind of is right. They do need some legal help around here well, because what a mess this what place for, is. It's time to pay Granny a visit. I bet she's been on tenterhooks for a while now. Misu, <laughs> how are you in tune with the game? Dialogue, I don't know. I just resonate. I'm also kind of an old fart at, at my soul. I, 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 was, I was talking to Nerva about this like the other day. But, uh, uh, but also, Little Hollow, how are you? You're so silly over in Hannah's chat. I love you. <laughs> um, I was talking to Nerva about this the other day, but I realized, like, my world is so small. <laughs> like, smaller than I think I ever really considered it. Smaller than I think most people ever. Because, like, my whole entire, like, world and life has just been, like, in my house even as a as a as a small child like i didn't really i never played at other people's houses and i only had someone come over to my house maybe like once a month you know and so there has never been like a lot of traveling or experiences or whatever that like to reminisce on a lot of it is just like me in my room <laughs> In my imagination, that's about it. But because of this, um, I, like I grew up in a, oh, also my parents like had me at an older age. And, uh, you know, they were like 30 when they had me where a lot of people have, you know, kids pretty early on. And so um, for me, <laughs> I, I am like all of their friends' kids were, were older. And everything so like sayings that my parents and like the older generation used to say comes out of my mouth because i never really hung out with kids my own age or whatever so i just like am like in like an, and i just consumed like tv that they watched or you know whatever and so uh yeah i think i just say like sayings and and things that like no normal like person says You've returned. How did it go? I got were old soul. Mm -hmm. this jadeite? Um, you were. Thank you, Yonfei. Good, good. Then we'll Hi, Jin. How are you doing today? Thanks for hanging out. Well, if we're all set, Granny, I'll get going now. Got a ton of clients waiting for me back at the office. Oh, you. All right then. Oh, go you. Go see your business. Granny should be able to handle the rest. I'm off then. Bye. Oh yes, traveler. Make sure you don't lose the business card I gave you. I've been looking into the laws of other nations as well. If you should ever bump into any trouble with the law, come find me directly. Regulars get discounts too. Come now, child. Are you leaving or are you not? If you have no wish to leave, perhaps you'd like to help me clean my teapot, hmm? <laughs> I'm leaving. I'm leaving. <laughs> <sighs> so cute. That child. Goodness knows where she learned to be so rambunctious. Her father was hardly so riotous or fond of talking nonsense back in the day when he stood beside Rex Lapis. A re truly unique adept, uh, Indeed she is. Liyue has changed, and the adept I must also learn to change. Yan I don't know what she is. I think she's a dragon. Garrus, she has scales. But she is also the most intimately acquainted with the city among us all. Ah, uh, Liyue is not the same place I once knew. All right, then. Uh, let us speak of this no more. Back on topic. I believe that I still owe you a little gift. Oh, Paimon's so excited! How is it made? And how long does it take? <laughs> it is but a single teapot. It shan't take long at all. Just... Wait here for a moment. Hey, Tommy how are you doing? Thanks for hanging out. Oh, there we go. This serenity pot is all yours now. Hold it firmly. If you were to drop it, oh, take these Who knows what would happen? You well. You'll need them if you wish to make your teapot a little more lively inside. Thanks, Granny. Wait a minute, Granny. How exactly are we supposed to use this teapot? 
Oh, you needn't worry about that. I love her voice that. actor so much. I've already arranged for a certain little helper to await you within this teapot. She will explain everything you need to know about it. Good morning, then. I hope you slept well and you have a good day ahead of you. Ah, oh, then happy, happy Lunar New Year to you. All right, to our pocket. Oh, so we just place it and then enter. <gasps> Wait, there's more than one location? Wow, look at look at the other places. Is someone under water? Wow, they've they've added a lot. <laughs> Floating abode, emerald. I think I had this. If I remember correctly. Floating abode. Island cluster suspended in midair. A typical feature of many adept realms. That looks really pretty. Or a beach. I want a snowy place! <laughs> I want this place, actually. It's pretty. Um, does it matter which one we choose? Kindred, hi! These people keep doing something with a katana and I can't escape it. Any tips? Uh, chat, Naraka tips for kindred buns. <laughs> I want the floating one. That's my choice. Thank you, Granny! I like the rainbow heart. That's so cute. Now you want wow. tea? This teapot seems even bigger inside than Madame Pink's. There's even a great big house in the middle, too. It's so pretty. Yeah. But there's just a whole load of nothing around it. Get chiseling, Paimon. You can carve out the whole house out of this I rock. I can't do that. <laughs> uh, well, you're the one with the sword anyway. You do it. You yeah. do it. Why is it so empty here apart from that house? Oh, wait a second. What is that? Wow, it's so pretty. <laughs> I don't care how empty it is. Wow, look over there. Can we go over there? So pretty. Maybe I should have done the wow. waterfall one. I kind of think. Oh, well. We have a visitor. It's a huge finch! Excuse me, I am not a finch. I am a teapot spirit, and you may call me. Um, hang on a moment. What am I supposed to be called again? Oh, she's so cute! Oh, call me. I suppose you may call me Tubby. Tubby! <laughs> so you're the little helper Madam you. Ping mentioned? Madam Ping? Oh, you must mean Ping. Yes, she did summon me here. She told me much about you. You may leave all matters regarding the upkeep of this realm to me. Your journey may be far from over. But at least this way, you will not want for a comfortable place to sleep each night. Oh, that's so wholesome. So what's a teapot spirit? Oh, you have to unlock it? Who create Should I have chosen a different this? background? They generally do Nani? not have the time of day to attend to the banal matter of their maintenance. Thus, we teapot spirits were created to help guard their realms and manage their affairs. You may consider me a butler, if you will. Now, allow me to explain this realm to you. Have you any blueprints on you? Specifically, Blueprints with beautiful rooms, chairs, and the like. As long as you have a blueprint, you can refashion this realm. Oh, however okay, you perfect. Please. Thanks, Nuggy. Blueprints? That'd be oh, so that's cute. Right. Granny handed us some when she gave us the teapot, didn't she? Let's take them out and have a look. Yes, these are the blueprints I'm talking about. Go on, open them up. Just commit the image of the objects to memory and prepare the necessary materials. Then simply release the thought from your mind and the object in the blueprint shall appear within this teapot. Yay! Wow! Is that all 
all it takes? Then we could build a whole city inside, couldn't we? Mm, I doubt it. A golden-eyed adeptus explained this to me at some point in the past. He said that even though subspace creation is a product of adeptal power, even that has its limits. This world is not a true one, after all. It provides merely a moment of brief respite from the mortal realm, not a means of escaping it entirely. A golden-eyed adeptus? Paimon wonders, who could that be? I hardly remember myself. What's more, I have never seen that adeptus again since. A very strange... Well, let's not dwell on that. Have a look around. Best you get accustomed to this realm. If there's anything you would like to ask, just look for me. Aw, so cute! There's some primos. All right. Oh. Happiness, please ensure that you follow our terms of service content. Oh, okay. Oh! They're just like, don't do anything naughty. Or we bonk bonk. Oh. Can we make a little guy? Oh, it's so cute! Oh my gosh! <laughs> little guy. Can you actually craft here? Like, is it usable? I feel like I'm using a Unity engine. <laughs> Guess we'll just put it here for now. It's convenient. Okay, sure. Or yarn. <gasps> Ooh, what's that? Uh, what are, what buttons? I want to like zoom over there. Oh, WASD. Duh. Whoa. Pretty. <laughs> Is that supposed to be the Geo Archon? Oh, and then up here, you could switch areas. I see. Ta da! Oh, wow! There's a little thing. There's a little dude. I should put my dude down. Hold on. I gotta put our little guy. He's just a little guy. Oh, wait. I could put Paimon! What? Okay. Paimon goes there. Um. Uh, I, I need like an all button. Where was the... The little dude? Where was the little dude? I don't, I don't think I put him down, right? I lost the little dude! Oh! I don't know what it does, but... There's the little dude. There he is. There we go. Okay. Oh, Paimon's so cute! Hey, a Paimon outfit. Return from call to single player modes during a special event. Okay. Teapot. Oh! Check the placement screen. Green wood. Enter the mansion. Process dies. Ooh, there's so much stuff to do. Traveler switch. Okay, the disclaimer. What is the replica? What does that mean? Like, is it make like a mini? What is the, I don't know what the replica thing is. 
Does it double something? Oh. What is this? <gasps> that is a cute little teapot house. The oh one my... before you is known as Jade Seeker. Ah! One travels far and wide, seeking not but to witness all of the treasures this world has to offer. I'm happy they brought the Fall Guys, like, Viper back, because I was... I was traveling when they had that event years ago, so I'm excited to get that one and get back in. Hi, Jerry! You know what characters you have in conversations? Replicas are a way to share teapot just Oh! Ah. Encounters with fine treasures cannot be forced. This is something that only fate may decide. Hey, Tubby! Ah! I remember I had a husky puppy, I think, when I had one. We'll have to save. We'll have to save up. He doesn't have anything too crazy and we don't have enough money. We are poor. We are poor. Okay. Let's go over here! Been lurking? Ah, no, don't be apologizing. Honestly, the lurks really support the channel a lot. I can I tell you a secret? Like, I, I really appreciate all the support and stuff because, like... I've been really all over the place with my content lately and trying to figure out what to do. And then also with like front page and like sometimes it's there, sometimes it's not. Trying to like figure out how to be a better content creator. I've been so sick. And then like trying to find sponsors and do all that. I've been a mess this month. And like just anybody who stops by, whether you're lurking or whatever, just the fact that you support, it means a lot. So thank you so much. Okay. Hi, Tubby! A little gift? Take the realm? What should I do next? Don't worry. Thing mentioned. Oh, yeah, modifications. Okay, marking. That was weird. It shall be li quite lively soon. Okay. Ah, okay. Whoa! It's so pretty! <gasps> the, there's even doors! Wow, there's like rooms! And they open! <laughs> wow... Is there rooms over... <gasps> there's one room over here. Oh, I got stuck. Oh, it's so beautiful! Wow! What's upstairs? It's really big. I wonder how much furniture you could put in this giant thing. Wow, it's so cute. Wow, I feel so fancy. Oh. Oh. Oh, <laughs> uh, okay. And then, how do you go, like, upstairs? How do I, like, yeah, how do I, oh, main hall. Corridor. Okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, wow. Those are what we're currently using. Oh, you can do internal stuff, maybe. What is that? Oh, yeah, our poster! We definitely want to keep that. I'm just gonna place stuff around. I'll have to- I'll definitely- this is something I'll spend time to- Ooh, what is that? I know I've gotten these from, like, stuff lately. Oh, it's like from the- from the play. Oh, cute! Ah! From our adventures! That's so cute! Oh, companions! I see. Cute! I'm gonna put Navia out to hang out. And we can put... Oh! I guess I can only invite one right now. Hi, Mon! <laughs> Cute! 
honored guest. The picture is so cute. Where did I put it? Wait. Did I not save? I thought I put it here. Maybe I need to leave and come back? I got the housey! Yeah! It's so cute. Go back in. I like the leeway music. Oh, I put it over here. I'm just stupid. <laughs> Oh, hello, hello! She has dialogue! This place is seriously cool. So, you and Paimon have this whole space to yourselves? It must feel a little empty sometimes. Maybe I should come and hang out more often. <laughs> oh. Why is that so cute? How do you like it here? I like this place a lot. It's really nice. The scenery is wonderful, and I love what you've done with the interior. Very tasteful. Very empty. Yes. Not as quite oh, as nice as your place. Don't be silly. It's not a competition. Every home's character is unique to its owner. It's not a question of good or bad, just personality. Yeah, that sums it up nicely. Your home is a reflection of your personality. She's so cute. Look around here, and I can tell that this place belongs to you and Paimon. What kind of style do you like hmm. in your home? Uh, cozy and practical, I guess. Beyond that, I'm really not that picky. Malouse actually did most of the interior decor at my place. I've always been quite fond of his style. And now that I've gotten used to it, I'm reluctant to change things up. She's so cute! And there's a little picture. There's my picture! That picture is really cute. I like it a lot. <laughs> Well, we did it. Um, process a die. Make a piece of fabric. Construct three furnishings. Obtain realm currency. And reach trust level two. Whoops. Oh, hello, hello. This place is ser... Um, would you like to have a chat with me? Sure thing. I mean, that's the whole point of coming here to hang out. Hmm. This so, is really cute. Uh, what's new with you? Hats! Can Anything we talk about hats for a second? Ah, yes, we certainly can. You know, you should consider getting yourself a hat. <laughs> and I don't mean a hat to keep your ears warm or your head dry. I just think your hairstyle would look really neat with a hat. Ah, uh, she's nice. Well, then maybe we should go clothes shopping together. Oh, yes! Sure. I'll take you to the best shop in all of Fontaine. Hmm. Let me think. Yeah, you and Paimon could both do with fancy outfits for formal occasions, as well as a hat and a new pair of leather shoes. Leather Actually, shoes? Come to think of it, how have you dressed for formal occasions in the past? Uh, pretty much just wear the same thing really? all the time. <laughs> huh. That's a surprise. <laughs> That's cool, though. I like how you don't get hung up on that kind of thing. I often find that people who don't stress about their appearance are the most chilled out. Whatever she is so pretty. Them, they just take it as it comes. No nonsense, no pretensions. <laughs> Honestly, I think that's pretty awesome. She I is guess so nice. The world that kind of confidence in you, huh? But still, let's definitely get you a nice hat and some leather shoes when we have the chance. You got it, girl. You got it. You know, you know the style. I appreciate it. Yo, they're so cute. <sighs> Leave the mansion. We did it! We got our teapot and so Wow! Views! Thank you so much for the all the hype! Oh my god, we must be on the front page. What? Maybe you're not used 11? to the place at yep. the moment, but once you've materialized enough rooms and Nah, yeah, second best girl, she's really sweet. Creation, it will feel just like home. Oh, uh, does Ayaka sing a song? Ooh, oh, wow. Okay, trust rank. Rank bonus. Claim rewards. Okay. Companion. Oh, we can make. We can get money. We love the money. All right. Switch realm style. Oh, that's how you do it. Reading furnishing. Oh, those are cute. Oh. We can make any of these then? 
I want to make that, but I don't, uh... Oh, wait. Oh, yeah, we can make cloth. Oh, is it instant? That's nice. Wait, what does this do? Oh, I see. Yellow. Oh, so you can make it out of either of those, depending on how much you have. <laughs> okay. Depending on the recipe. Yeah, it's like a little fishy. It kind of reminds me of the Naraka one. Make some dyes. I feel like we might as well make things, right? Oh. What do we make with this? Oh. Does do, do any of these makes the wood then? I see. Okay, then can we make the fish? Yeah! <laughs> It's gonna take 15 hours. Okay. Yet to be learned. Oh, I uh, I have to learn them. I see. I'm dumb. Um, oh, we can only make one at a time. No! I want it now. <laughs> I want the fish and I want it now. <laughs> There's a rug. Okay, I want to make this little this little lantern. How long does it take? Well, they're so long. Do they all take that long? Oh, everything takes that long. Well, it is what it is. Lamp time it is! Woohoo! Cool. Um, Realm Depot. Oh. It looks like it... We could buy so much! Oh. I grant oh, look at all the bushes! Whoa, there's so much furnishing I can't even! Dude, look at the scrolling! Nuggy, you guys in chat, do you guys already have all of these, like... Uh -huh, like, do you have every... <gasps> look at all the colors of trees! Do you guys, like, have everything on the... Oh, seal of... Provincial ahead uh, priestess. That's cute. Look at oh, look at the archway. I want that. I've been running as long progress as we're getting to just do in the background. Ah, uh, that's fair. It's kind of I like idle games, so I can't complain. There's so much stuff to buy. Those are just plants. Happy times. Furnishing. The scroller is even smaller. <gasps> I like the lights. Oh, there's a fireplace. There's so much furniture. Oh my god. I pl I played when this update came out. Originally, long, long ago. And there was not very many furniture. Whoa, what are these like? Secret research. Those look these look important. What do the scrolls do? Whoa. Look at how much Oh! Hot springs! Look at how much furniture there is! Oh my gosh! I have a small area I made for Valentine's last year if you want to see. Yo, send me a picture! The store there is a, a purple moon looking that you can buy that gives you 40 stamina that you can use for resin. I definitely in the future will start buying that. Let me exchange. Oh. 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 Of the waypoint? That seems nice. These do th Oh, there's a baba baba. Fireworks! Can you like light them off? Oh my god, there's so many cute things. Creep. Oh. I'm sorry, I'm just having a moment. <laughs> okay. Um. I want. Um. What should I buy? 
I'm like, what should I buy? I wanted the archway. Oh, there's a little kitty. That's cute. I like the shroud. Oh, I like that. I want this. And I want... Oh, these aren't blueprints. They're just items. Like... What are? Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the Poopa Squad. I just took one of the biggest poops just now. Yo, congrats, because... As an IBS sufferer, I am jealous of you. I just want you to know that. I just I just want you to know if you ever that it's no fair that you can have good poops. Okay? I'm incredibly endlessly jealous of you and I just want you to know that. Da -da -da. Ampli, how are you doing? Maybe you are not used to there goes all of Mizu's money. There it goes. You're right. You're right. Well, these are blueprints. I want to make that. It's a little, little, little sectional thing. Okay, you know what? We can buy these. So, like, why not? Right? Right? Um, and then we needed to create three things anyway, right? Yeah. We can buy them every day, so 10. So, like, might as well. Let's make that next. There we go. We've made some stuff. Thank you for the hydrate. How are you doing? Yeah. If I have no control have over my life, let alone realm. my bowel movements, and it's fine. Sending you love. Sending you, sending you, sending you jealousy. <laughs> Okay, and reach trust rank level two. How do you do that? <laughs> does it just happen over time? How does it work? Thank you for the hydrates, by the way, chat. Oops. <gasps> it's so pretty. How do I move it? There we go. Why does it want to lock? I don't want it to. That looks so cute, right? I wish you could put it up here. Like, right on there, but... Cute. What else do we got? We got rocks. We got trees. We don't have any flowers. We have this. This is so cute. Can it go behind Paima? Oh my gosh, yeah, it can. Cute. And then, oh my gosh, the fish is huge. I love it. I absolutely love it. That thing is so chonk, but I love it. Look at him, he's beautiful. <laughs> Such a Mizu, Mizu kind of thing. The upgrades are, uh, as you make furniture. Oh, okay, so it upgrades as you make furniture. I see. I see, I see, I see. I see. I see. So we got a ways to go. I see. Thank you guys for all the hydrates. Another, Amply, how are you doing today? One eye, how are you? How is everybody? All right. Does it help having, like, furniture out <laughs> by chance? I don't know. Can I put more? Can I can I put another person outside? Probably not. I think I don't have any more outdoor things, right? Okay. Oh, it's so cute! I love it. Let's go back inside. <laughs> Where do fruits go on vacation? <laughs> Yo, you know what? One R, I feel like normally someone probably, you probably, you're probably one of those people, like one of my other viewers who talks a lot about cheese, who goes into a chat and you say something random and someone bans you, but you know, I just want you to know that I appreciate you. I, li I like your randomness and I am a sucker for dad jokes. I love it. Give me them dad jokes all day. 
And I'll laugh at every single one of them uncontrollably. <laughs> I will. I will. Uh, I love them. I, I got wait. Okay, I wasn't that excited about the teapot, but now it's out. Of, I am out of control with my excitement for the teapot. Honestly, I'm I'm enjoying myself here. Should I be just doing adventures and not dawdling? Probably. But am I just gonna d d like just put stuff everywhere? Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely. Oh, that was probably supposed to go there. I'm just throwing stuff at this point everywhere because I was like, we're doing it. Look how cute! So cute! We have all the decorations! We're so cool! <laughs> Wanna come see the teapot? Oh, I guess I can if you want. And then after I come visit you, I have to take a pee pee. <laughs> Don't judge me, okay? Maybe you I'm holding my PPP. Did you ever have it? Magnificent. It's pretty. I like it. I like it. I like it. Oh yeah, how do I do this? Oh. Do we, from those do you just get like a random Chat, we have a blue wish. Okay, let's do it. I'm going to we're going to do the clap Give us something good! We're actually getting really close to a five-star pity. Imagine. <laughs> but I'll come see, Nuggy. Are you at your teapot right now? Are you at your teapot right now? I will come see. Purple for Mizu! I, I just want more gomming and, and Noelle's, honestly. So, and if I happen to pull her, I'm happy, you know? that weapon and i don't have very many of those like long swords so you shouldn't wait i know i gotta pee <laughs> it's good we to see that you're already feeling for better from your previous cold honestly things. it's been such a chaotic thing i've been sick for a month as of the fourth which is just so annoying but other than that like, it's just, like, tired and exhaustion and then, like, the boogers, you know? It's not, like, terrible. It's just enough to be, like, under the weather, you know? But we out here. Wait, a young woman did not fart in her husband's lap and here's a jadja. What? Something has never occurred since time. Emo what? A young woman did not fart in her husband's lap and there's a dad joke for you. Why don't eggs tell jokes? Because they might crack up. What about the fart? Oldest known joke is a Sumerian proverb? What? Okay, I have to wait for you. Okay. So then I go to friends. And then I go to Nuggy. And then request to visit Serenity Pot. Go pee your pee pee monster. Ah, what's a pirate? Oh, arc. I can't wait. Go to the bathroom. Okay, I gotta pee. I'm not looking. I gotta pee. Yeah. Even if an antique is priceless, the happiness it brings lasts for only the moment that you obtain it. Diesel, <laughs> 
has returned from the pee 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 Thank you for it, Lippy Pee. That unlocked. He's a god of being a thousand yard stick. <laughs> okay, okay. Oh, oh, it's purple! Okay, 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 okay. Oh! You saw nothing. The music is so pretty. The music just changed! Nogi disappeared! Ah! Where did they go? Where are you? Are you in the house? <laughs> There's a girl on TikTok who made a channel uh, against holding it because she got sick from it. Oh, I have a... Okay, wait. Are you in the house, Nogi? Open your map. Oh, you're over here. Or wait, is that not you? Wait. Oh, gosh! Wait, it's huge! Okay. I have a story about the... About PP after... Oh! How do you walk? How do I... Alt? You have, a, you have a jail that you made for just specifically for a child that's pretty funny out. Why can I touch things? What happens if I touch it? I think I just stole things from your house. <laughs> wow! This is so pretty! I love all the colors of the trees! Nuggy taking me on a romantic date before our date with Mizu. How dare? No, I'm just kidding. Oh my gosh, it lines up right with the moon too. Dude, this is so cute. Wow, this is really pretty. Uh, you did this last year? This is nice. This is really cute. Chat, everybody applaud Nuggy for being so creative. I have a story. Do you want to hear about Nuggy while we're sitting here on our romantic date? Do you want to hear about the story about my pee? <laughs> what does what does a snowman use to go to school? I don't know what. <gasps> oh wait, shoot. No, tis the sea. <laughs> no, <laughs> little hollow, you set me up for that. Good, you did an icicle. <laughs> an icicle. Oh my god, these dad jokes are good. Okay, so when I was a kid, so chat, I'm realizing as an adult, do you ever like look back at things that like happened to you at school, and and you realize that they were not good, and you're like. Why did this happen to me? Like, and you're like, God, who who allowed that? Anyway, so when I was in school, we used to only be able to go to the bathroom twice a day. Like, there was like a, a rule. And you weren't supposed to, in high, when they got to high school, you weren't supposed to even go to the bathroom during class. And if you, d and there was, yeah, no, I'm not even, yeah, yeah, I only realize this now as an adult. Oh my God, BRB, my cat peed on my, oh my God, I'm summoning, I'm literally summoning everybody to pee themselves. <laughs> no, okay, sorry, I, uh, like, when you, we were talking about not holding your pee, you, like, literally summoned this memory out of my, <laughs> uh, like, out of my out of my memory. So as an adult, I now understand why I pee so often. But as a child, I didn't, right? There's like some things that I have a heart condition and a nervous system condition, and it causes me to pee extra. So I'm always dehydrated, right? Like I only as an adult, it took until I was like 22 for doctors to be like, oh, you need to drink way more water. And I was like, I do drink water. And they're like, double it triple it and like that's how it was so anyway so anyway i just remember 
as a kid. Oh, Nuggy's favorite waifu. <laughs> so as when, so, I went to uh, a school. I graduated one of eight students. They give it a high grade. And K through 12 is all in the same building. But when you're up till sixth grade, everybody at the beginning of class, be, before lunchtime, there's a card you can take with your name on it. And once you take your card, you're not allowed to pee again in the morning. You have to wait till lunch. And then at lunch, you're supposed to pee. And then afternoon, you have another card. If you take both cards in the day, you would be reprimanded for peeing twice in a day. And if you had to pee again, you would have detention after school. <laughs> I'm not joking. I'm not joking. And as an adult, I realized, what the farts? That's not normal. But I didn't know any better. And so, so, so then when you get into high school, we, we went to a four day school week. And so like we had extra long days and, but like the bells between classes were only two and a half minutes or three minutes. And so you had to, not that it was a big school, but you had to literally get between class between three minutes, right? How do you get to your locker, grab your stuff, drop off your other stuff, go pee and still make it to class between, how do you pee? There's only four stalls as well. So if anybody else is peeing, have fun with like, how do you pee? And then there's a clock for your thing. And if you have to go to the bathroom in the first 15 minutes of your class, you get reprimanded. You're supposed to wait at least a half hour into the class or like 15 minutes into the class. I'm not joking. This was in high school. And I remember that I was starting to get sick when I was older and and I had to go like get a bunch of blood draws. Well, the local lady could never get me. So I went during my lunch break, go poked and get prodded, right? And they cannot get a blood draw. They poked me four times. They can't get it. So literally like then they were like, OK, drink a bunch of water, eat this thing, drink that, whatever, come back. So I'm in my class and I'm chugging water. The teacher knows why. I ended up having to pee four times during his class. And he's like, what the heck? And I'm like, I don't know what to tell you. You can freaking blood draw me, like whatever. And then another time I finally got fed up with it because I started having to hydrate more, right? And he got mad at me and wasn't gonna let me go to the bathroom in his class. And so I lied and I told him that I was on my period. And if he didn't let me go, I was gonna bleed all over his seat. And it, and it was a man teacher and his face just turned beet red and he never didn't let me go to the bathroom again. <laughs> so yeah. There's my PP story. <laughs> 200 IQ. You know what? I'm getting scared, but he went. I did have horrible periods, but I wasn't on my period. I just lied. I had to take a pee. I would walk out of mine. They just said you don't have to ask, but you would still get annoyed. You didn't even have to ask to go to the bathroom. Oh my god! And then in college, we weren't allowed to have any liquids at art college in the art rooms for four hour classes. And I just, you know, the older I get, the more I learn about the world, I realize what, where, what have I been experiencing? <laughs> this stuff doesn't happen. <laughs> where have I been now in my life? Uh, I was sitting in science class and then had to fart. I was hoping it was going to be a quiet one. Wasn't super loud, but the funny part is the girl behind me had her head down on the desk, so it fart went up the back of the chair. Yo, thank you guys for watching the ad. Thank you for watching the ad and supporting the channel. And her head down on her desk, so the fart went up back of the of the chair into her face. She yelled at me, then the teacher yelled at her, told her she shouldn't have had her head down on the desk in the first place and paying attention, and that she wouldn't have got farted in the <laughs> That's amazing. Talking about pee once in high school, a kid peed in my math teacher's coffee because he gave my classmate extra. That's felonious assault, isn't it? <laughs> or something. Oh my God, that you could get arrested for. 
Yeah, we had a teacher who just said, you can leave whenever you want without asking and come back whenever you want. Yo, that's nice. I was at high school where you had one or two classes a day and the rest of the day is self-study time. That sounds amazing. That sounds amazing. Uh, anyway, Nagi, do you have anything else to show in your in your teapot? But yeah. Yeah. I, I felt like proud of that. Yeah, he was always kind of a jerk. And he always put the really big boobed girls in the front row. And he would always yell at them to pull up their shirts. But why was he looking there? It's really pretty. It's really pretty. Uh, a Lear song? Can you- yeah, do you have a loot, Nuggy? Do you got a loot? Ooh, so pretty and zoomy. But yeah. Oops. Very nice, Nuggy. Very nice. Very nice. Great lyric song. Thank you for letting me be in your teapot. It was it was a joy and a pleasure, good sir. Thank you very much. Nuggy is so talented. So talented. But yeah, after 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 I told him I was gonna bleed in his seat, he never asked me again. He never cared. He just let me go pee pee, and I, I, and I got to go pee pee way more than everybody else got to go pee pee, and I felt like I, yeah, I felt like a baller. And everybody stared at me with jealousy, and I was like, you know what? Really, I, I came up with it first, so you know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just big brain like that. Thank you for showing us though. Your your teapot was super cute and I'm sorry I ruined it with pee-pee talk. <laughs> it was a good school for self-motivated people, but procrastinating was your worst enemy at that school. Ah, fair. I would love that Maybe kind of thing because not... I like do working on one thing at a time and just like bum rushing it. My senior year of high school, I uh, I did online classes and only damage. needed three to graduate. I only needed three to graduate, so so I literally you three weeks would open up at a time on the online classes, and so what I would do is I would I would like wait so it was like a week on time a week ahead of a week behind right so I would literally like wait and only do homework every three weeks and then on Monday I would get when it opened up I get all of it done and then I wouldn't do work again for another three weeks and it was great it was fabulous but also, I, I like you said, I was very self-motivated. So yeah, very self-motivated. So I cannot complain. <laughs> yeah. Hi, Fluffy. How are you doing? I don't see the point in refusing a kid to go to the bathroom. Yeah, apparently at my school is a problem because all the every single classroom had rules about going to the bathroom. So, and it was just normal. And now as an adult uh, who has, I had a, I, for a while had a bladder spasm. That's a thing. <laughs> and, and, uh, and, and it had issues. So now as an adult, I look at it and I'm like, bro, fishing association. Wait, I have a quest, <laughs> but yeah. That was a beautiful tune. Only time, Queen is Sorry, my voice is still not all the way. One Slay Fox, hello! Thanks for hanging out. Association, Fisting Association, a business, delicious fish. Let's go check it out. Yo! We're just unlocking all of the quests. Okay. Um, boop, 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 Exploding population and leeway harbors. And leeway harbor. So many things, so many things, so many things. 
So we got the teapot with Madam Ping, and then I. Think we just were. Ah, no. Leeway. No. Where was the leeway quest where we were helping? Paimon return leeway. Return to part of the annual lantern riot. So familiar faces. Justice for books. I swear we were doing a quest to help. To, to help rebuild the Jade Palace or the Jade, whatever. I don't remember which one that is. Um, hate the fact that in school you had five minutes to go between classes and then you wanted to go to the bathroom and then you ended up late. It's your fault. Yeah. And then they get mad. Why didn't you go between classes? There's no winning. I'm more insane stories about school, but I'm not sure if you want to hear them. I mean, it's, it's up to you if you feel like sharing. Chat, do you guys mind if we swap for a little bit and we do the sponsor part of the stream and then we'll come back later? We'll play some more Genshin. I know we didn't get that far today because today I've been all over the place, but today is a very special day because I don't get sponsors that often. And in, if you haven't guessed it by the corner of the stream, we are sponsored by... Da -da -da -da. Hold up. Firetrack! Fleet command. And it's kind of exciting. It's kind of exciting. So, oh, give me one second. The change <laughs> drops. Not that. Start stream really quick. No worries. Thank you for lurking. Thank you for showing me your uh your teapot, and I'll be back on later. Also, reminder for everybody: tomorrow is Lunar New Year, so happy Lunar New Year! We're gonna be making New Year's wishes together. Just a reminder: you guys can download the um if you guys would like to download the artwork to make your wishes on. Um, we had these custom Dadima dolls made. So feel free to download and print them out or put them on your phone or whatever. And we'll be making wishes tomorrow. How you use a dot of a doll is you fill in an eye and make a wish. And then when a wish comes true, you fill in the other one. And I thought it would be super fun because instead of having like New Year resolutions, I like having New Year's like, you know, goals and wishes and dreams and stuff. So I feel like that's fun. Okay. Okay, Star Trek. Oh man, fleet Star Star. Oh, there's a lot of them. Oh man. Okay, I gotta figure out, make sure I don't grab the one. Called Star Trek Fleet. Okay. There's a lot of Star Trek games. Oh my goodness. Okay, there we go. I was like, oh no. I gotta make sure I'm in the right one. And then I think there it is. Also, chat, remember how we were sponsored to play um that that pirate game? Do you guys remember? <laughs> I've been playing it in my own time, like on my phone like crazy since we played it on stream the other day. Okay, I'm going to be doing it as a new player because I wanted to experience it for the first time with you guys. If you guys would like to, um, yeah, it was, it was, let me, dude, I'm so bad with names. It's like one of my weakest. It's called Sea of Conquest. I've been playing it. It's really fun. It's been really fun. Let me turn down the volume. Yeah, it's it's 
so fun. I was really enjoying it. I really love mobile games. I every single day I play easy or like slow life isekai when I before I go to bed every single day because I feel like I have to make so many decisions like every single day and being able to like Space, feel like I can't the like, final front oh no 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 hold on hold on it's a little too loud scooch okay Here, three factions prepare for war the united federation of planets the klingon empire and the Romulan Star Empire. To survive this conflict, you'll need to upgrade your station, build iconic starships, Wait. and recruit legendary- Whoa, that's a lot of people we can recruit. You have the con, Commander. Welcome to Star Trek Fleet Command. Yo, that's kind of epic. I like completing tasks it feels like so satisfying and everything and I feel like everybody kind of loves Star Trek so I thought this would be fun for us to do when I was doing an apprenticeship at a program at school we had this really sketchy classmate who was for most of the year and one day he wasn't in class we got told that he stole from a handicapped kid's locker that's so terrible oh my gosh but yeah, if you guys would like to uh, play with us, I really appreciate it. This supports the channel and everything. We're bit today is sponsor stream to shout out to Star Trek Fleet Command as well as Stream Elements for helping us get this sponsorship. I really appreciate it. I don't get sponsorships that often. And I really appreciate companies who are willing to work with me and for the opportunity, as well as all the, the viewers who uh, offer to play and everything. We get supported every time somebody, so it, we don't even have like a minimum level. It's every single one of you who participates counts towards a goal, which is so crazy. So if you reach level five, unlock a second ship, or reach level 10 all of those levels like support the channel so thank you so much also there's a promo code for work this is both you you can click the link and download mobile or desktop i'm supposed to push for mobile but it, it works on both so yeah <laughs> So it's really exciting and there's a promo code and also we're gonna be uh, we have a goal of making our own uh, Like fleet or whatever like an alliance. So we'll be making our own alliance to play together as well in the future. Okay Good thing you're here. I've been stuck out here fixing. Hang on. You're not the star fleet You clearly not the Romulans or Klingons either um, Well, whoever you are, I need your help Take a seat at Tactical. Let's get these weapons trained on identifying the weak points of some enemy ships. Time your shots and take down the targets on the screen. Let's go! Go. Yo, your game is giving... Dude, that's a lot of giveaways, monkey. Let's go. You've been playing it for 10 years. What game is it? Some important life lessons to learn in the Star Trek writing. We... Uh, can I tell you a secret? Let me know in the chat. Let me know in the chat... How many of you guys have played, like, watched Star Trek? And what is your favorite Star Trek? Because maybe we should do, like, a movie night <laughs> and, like, watch some. Because I've never, I know, like, some of it, but I've never, like, sat down and watched it. And I always love watching Ash said hi, like, play Star Trek online. So, yeah. Okay, let's, just, we choose the target. Oh, oh wow, there, there's a, t oh, that's kind of hard. Yo! That feels so satisfying. Okay, yo, wait, did we got Kirk times five? You clear filed some phasers, fired some phasers before. Great work. You could be useful on my rescue mission. Come on, you're with me. I'm picking up distress calls from nearby colony. We're going to have to take your ship for a look, Commander. Yo. Star Trek Voyager 7 of 9 was so hot. Wait, what? And I uh, smite. Remember when I was a kid, it pushed me into a wall and I cut my forehead and I didn't realize it was uh, when I was getting on the bus. I got home and bus driver was like, what happened to you? And nothing. Oh, no. That's so sad. I knocked myself out on the playground because I hit my head on the monkey bars and my, and my teachers wouldn't let me call my parents to tell them. And in hindsight, I was knocked out. So I had a concussion and nobody let me report it. I recently remembered that because I was talking to my neurologist and I like I have like memory loss from my childhood that just randomly comes back like I have like flashbacks and like 
I I recently because like we uh I've talked to some different doctors and they always ask if I had head trauma before and not that that one is like enough for it to count but I realized I was like oh yeah this one thing and then my mom's like what <laughs> and, 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 <laughs> you know and I came home with a giant goose egg on my head. Okay, travel here with your ship. Oh my god. This is going to be so much Oh my gosh, this is going to be so much like the one we just played the other day. The 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 pirate one. Oh my gosh. I love it because you can travel across the map and you map it out and I just love like like endlessly like grinding just to even map out the map. Like because there's like busy work even though you do dailies and I love that. Um Cardassian vessel, cease your bombardment of this colony or we will be forced to open fire. I wish there was a voice uh, like dialogue. That's the only thing I wish that was there. Stand between us and our right to conquer planets as we see fit. A foolish endeavor, human. You will provide a meager opportunity to, for target practice. Delivering power to, of your weapon system. Commander, red alert. Prepare for battle! Okay, we're gonna attack them. Ooh, strength. Uh, normal. Okay. I don't know. At least we got the zoomies. Our starship is cute. Let's go! Targets destroyed. Great job, Commander. I'll open a channel for the colonist. Thank you for intervening. We've had trouble for weeks. Typically, the Cardassians, like, send hired thugs, but today they came in full force. Hopefully, you've seen the last of them, Commander. Let's head to the station. So then, return to the ship. I'm sure you're aware that you've been flying around in the middle of a uh, war zone. Surely you haven't survived out through sheer luck, though. The Federation of Klingons and the Rumulans are in constant conflict. Independent like you will be caught in the middle of all of it. If you have to choose a side, I know you're going to make the right choice. Uh, so we have to choose a side. Who are we going to choose? Uh, what's this? I'm detecting wreckage nearby from the Klingon vessel. Let's go see if the computer core is intact. We go! That made me think of the time I split my chin open in elementary school and I had to go to the nurse's office and they put the blood butterfly band-aids and they gave me a lunch and it was spaghetti but it was so wet and it kept go getting into the wound and stinging. Oh no! That's like the worst combination. Dude, you got like hurt a lot at school. I'm running a sensor sweep from wreckage. There's some clear signs of... Thank you for head pads. Thanks for hanging out, Nozo. Um, rolling disruptor damage here. I'll beam what's left of the computer core on board. Let's head back to the station and analyze it. Let's go. You're a wild child. Shaking my head. Analyst complete. Um, with this data, I will be able to update our battle simulator to give you some more experience in combat. You're going to need it. Step in and take a seat. Familiarize, uh, familiarize yourself with the tactical console. Let's test out the weapons system commander. I'm going to put music back on in the background. Since just stop. Um, complete the combat simulation. Okay, let's do it. Yo, this ship looks like it has a face like like a little crocodile face or and like or something or like looks like a like look at the like this is the eyes and then like this is the schnoot and then maybe this is like big ears or something <laughs> you kind of get my drift okay so we're gonna choose the target and then fire yay Oh, wait, I don't. Okay, you can just double click. You don't have to click the thing. That's my bad. I didn't. I didn't get. Dude, it's kind of hard. Yeah, like, like a Kermit the Frog. Yeah. My um, reaction time is not very good. <laughs> okay, let's go. Nice work. We completed the mission. Human, you have stolen the spoils from the Klingon vessel. We were investigating. Oh no, they're not gonna be mad. They're gonna fight us for it. That's okay. We'll attack you right back. Let's do it! They're gonna just have to go down. 
great job. We scared them off. We should head back to safety. All right, let's go. Also, if anybody would like to play with us, this is how you download, and I really appreciate all the support and everything you guys trying out a game with me. Um, for trouble, Commander, but like myself. All right. I'm getting kind of used to playing games like this. A lot of them have very similar setups and it helps a lot because like, I'm kind of bad at stuff. Tap on this area to show what you can build. Okay, we can build something and then speed it up. We got a generator. <laughs> build the parasol warehouse, okay. And we build it. We can speed it up. All right. We got the zoomies. I was, what's also cool about these new sponsorships is they encourage you because they have auto tracking of like when you're actually live, they encourage you to split up your, your gameplay and stuff. And I feel like that's so much more successful. Like we could play this in between like Naraka games and stuff. And I feel like that'll be like something good we can do throughout the week because we have eight days to do the sponsorship. So I feel like that's really nice that like they allow that kind of thing. To like break up the gameplay and stuff. I kind of like that a lot more. Hi, Talise, how are you doing? I'm doing good. I still got the cooties, gosh. I think it's like been the worst is like just how sick I've been is like, well, but other than that, I'm doing good. How are you? We're going to need the station firing at all cylinders, including its commander. There's a test that the command students take, a star uh, Starfleet ac Academy called the Kobayashi Maru. All right, let's go do it. I hope we can like customize our ship and make it pink. That's my goal. That's my dream. going to wish to not be sick anymore for the rest of the year yeah that's what i would like dude i just can't believe that it just like i, I it won't go away i guess it sh it's kind of makes sense though because like i just don't have a very like strong body i already have pre-existing health duties you know so it's not like it's not like you know weird that weird oh look at the ships they have like or is this a city no this is like, look at it it's like a whole freaking city um it's not that weird that it's like lasting forever it just sucks that i caught it like two or three times my parents also are going out of town again for, to the hot springs and i'm telling you if uh okay chat we gotta make we gotta make our own alliance. This is part of our quest. Is that how you spell alliance? I hope so. There we go. And our tag will be, uh, Mizu. If we can. There we go. Let's do it. Which one is... Oh, that one's cute. That one just looks cute. Which one's the most poopa squatty? Hmm. I like the purple one. That one's pretty. Hmm. I like this purple one. That one's fun. But this one... Yeah, I like the purple one. We'll do that one. Okay, uh, private only invitation only or any players can join public alliance. How does that work? I guess anybody. Oh, no, it's it can. Uh, is it the dot? Or is it the poopa squad? Oh, it's, you can't say poop. Okay, there we go. How's that? Dang it! Can't say the poopa squad. What the heck? 
story of my life. Going to wish to not be, yeah, I, I'm not doing anything. It's raining and uh, just watching uh, streams and, ah, well, thank you for hanging out with us, Tellies. Star base. Never thought I'd hear pre existing cooties. Yeah. Dude, I just got all the cooties and they're just never going. I, I think I've been sick three times. I was thinking about it. I got better and then I had a fever in the middle of it. And then I got better, better. And then my parents got home from the, the hot springs and then I got sick again. So. Yeah, it's annoying. <laughs> Should have gotten your circle, circle, dot, dot, cootie <laughs> Dude, I just got all the cooties. But yeah, it's like just the longest like buggers and just feeling sick ever. That's the annoying part. Redacted, hi, how are you doing? And Rudeness, hi, thanks for hanging out. Are you going to need to be on a specific server too? I, will, I don't know. Chat, do you guys know? Shadow, thank you for the head pats because that's part of our goal is to make an alliance. So, um, I'm kind of waiting for like the the tr like the auto us doing this to be over, so we can like, cause I kind of want can <laughs> I can't click other things and pause, you know? Like I, we gotta just go through the 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 zoomy through the this. <laughs> Let's see. Let me let me go to my account soon. Thank you for headbats, Shadow Knight. How are you doing? Let's, uh, okay, wait. Can we go to our account? Okay, let's see. Officer. TTV Mizuki. How about that? Um. Is there servers? Like, that's what I'm trying. Oh my gosh, there's a doggy. Oh my gosh. There's Doge. Cute. Oh my gosh, wow. Look at the... Oh, Valentine's Day 2021. I'm jelly. I want all the Valentine's Day stuff. Maybe we can get it this year. There's a lot. Yo, she's hot. <laughs> I just want the doggo. I want the doggo. That one's like... Okay. Yo, okay. Anyway, um... This is my player profile. I'm not sure. Uh, this is my ID game version. Oh, there is music. The music was off. That's fine. I was say it was like trying to find this my game ID so you guys could add me. I'm a, I guess you, it's not server based, I'm assuming. I think anybody can join. I don't know, that's what mine is. Uh, I should be fine. We'll see how it works. You guys, uh, if you guys can join mine because it seems pretty quickly in the beginning, it lets you join anybody. So um, if you guys wanna join, um, yeah. <laughs> enough headbats thank you for all the headbats um my brain can't handle you talking so fast but you, oh i'm sorry can we just search the mizu tag i would assume so hopefully that made it easy that's what i was hoping for can you get to a stopping point point can i some Thank you guys for hanging out though. So yeah, if you guys want to join, it really supports the channel a bunch. So thank you. Well, and we need to get five people to join our alliance. That's our goal. Oh, we should probably wear like the, our main outfit. Thank you guys for watching the ad. It really supports the channel a bunch. Thank you so much. And today we're sponsored by Star Trek uh, Fleet Command. And if you guys want to come play with us, uh, we are trying to hit uh, level 5, level 10, and unlock two ships. That's our goals and everything. And I think if hitting level 10 and doing all that, it takes about two hours as well. 
Um, but we'll be splitting it up among amongst a few different streams. And then also, uh, Warp Speed will get you extra in-game goodies. And we're going to be making our own little, little crew, little alliance. So if you want to join mine, just look for the Mizu tag. And it should be just called TTV Mizu Key. Like, I was trying to, like, make it as easy as possible for you guys to join. So, um, oops. <laughs> Ooh, the, 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 perhaps we should investigate. Ooh, we're going for it. Let's go. You know, that made me wonder when you hear another language being spoken, does it sound sped up when people are talking? Is, I don't want to say it here is Spanish, but not English speakers. Do they speak? Ah, I don't know. I guess it probably depends on the language, but thank you for the head pads and thanks for hanging out. Okay, there is a Nausicaan vessel that matches the configuration. I'll open the channel to him. I am sister of Gavalar. My name is Urquin. Commander, they're attempting to hijack a light holder. I guess we're, we're just here to take them down and not let them be little stinkers. Let's do it! Bad. Bad stinkers. Bad stinkers. We bonk them. Yo, we got goodies though. Oh, you have to make an account. We probably will we'll do that. I'll do that off stream. Um, claim that for the server. Then what's our server? What server are we on? We definitely need to figure that out. Someone let me know, by the way. Um, What server and everything. PC welcome. Ooh, all for PC launch. Nice. Those are a lot of goodies. Nice, 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 nice. Um, they would have killed every last one of us, but you saved us. Thank you. Dude, she's cute. It sounds like you're rapping. <laughs> um, there's a large warship approaching and configuration is unknown to me. They sent me a crest. Um, what have we here? You are not Starfleet. What a quaint little ship you have. I am Subcommander uh, Sinilis of the Romulan Star Navy. A bounty hunter wanted for high crimes against the Empire is hiding somewhere in the system. Maybe you could help bait him out. Ooh, we're going to help him. Okay. We're level two, I think, right now. I just wanted to be able to, like, click on stuff. And explore stuff. Ooh. Oh, these are the different ships. Ooh, there's so many! Oh, look at that one's purple. Whoa! Wow! Officers. I don't think we've recruited any officers yet. We just... Oh. Next gen... Try, Troy. So this is our officer. Yo, at least is a... We're a cute little lady. We're a little... And she has... She's empathetic. There, there's so many. There's so many to unlock. Oh my gosh. My like, I gotta catch them all. Oh, the cartoon looking ones. The, I, my, I gotta catch them all like feeling and just like gets me going. Is purple the best then? They don't have like a gold or red level, I'm assuming. Do we have like poles for recruiting? Ooh, ultra recruit. Oh, and then there's the different federations. If you want to to be on the I see, I see, I see. I'm learning, chat. I'm learning. It, it'll probably teach me, and I'm like skipping ahead. <laughs> All right, we attack the Regalian destroyer. We're gonna go get him. We're gonna get him. Evil sister for. Oh my gosh, she kind of does. Oh my gosh, don't say that. No, that's supposed to be our person helping us. Oh, gosh. <laughs> Maybe I underestimated you. Yeah, you did. You did underestimate us. Also, I'm just going to put this, like, right here. I think that's a better spot for it. Um, you did. You did. But that's okay. We got this. Do you aim to torpedo after all? Very well. Bounty hunter we're seeking should be nearby. Let's get up. We're going for it. Go. Maybe... How does that work? Oh! Intervention, locate, upgrade, parasite... Oh! I am conducting a sensor sweep. 
Target located. Oh, shoot, 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 shoot. I didn't need to click anything. We just had to wait. That's my bad. Disable the bounty hunter's ship? Okay. Um, attack. I don't think we really need to scan because we're just going for it. Oh, that's someone else's sh ship. You have my gratitude. Resourceful independence like yourself can be ma uh, make quite a career with the right contracts, you know. Perhaps you may serve us again sometime. All right. Um, anyone out here, please respond. We've crash landed on this planet. There's no breathable atmosphere outside the ship. We have a critical hole breach. We're running out of time. All right, let's go help them. Yeah, like what? I'm trying to figure out. Reputation is neutral. There's our ship announcement. Starbase combat territory. Like, I wanted to see, because, yeah, you would think. Is there like a map maybe with M? Um, we have assist, wounded crew. My ship is tearing itself apart. So, uh, how will you help the crew? Recruit data, repair the ship. Recruit Beverly, treat the. Oh. I think we need to fix the ship first because the oxygen is like being ruined and then we can help people. You are able to contain the whole breach, yeah. We trying. I'll try to help you the best we can. I'm coming. Wait for me. Okay, back to our alliance. I'm like looking. Combat territory. Yeah, you would think like maybe there'd be a map. Never would have survived without you. Yay. Mission complete. We did it. The old Ferengi proverb, expand or die, is wise advice in a galaxy at war. As a fleet commander, Ooh, you must upgrade your nice. station to extend your capabilities. Expand your crew by recruiting new officers. Construct powerful new ships and explore the galaxy. Defeat dangerous enemies, testing your commander's prowess. The final frontier is yours, Commander. Make it so. All right. I was making, I'm trying, I need to be better about making those like posts on um uh on on the story for twitch i keep forgetting that that's a thing but i need to use it more okay um you can enhance the ship's offense and okay okay repair and manage the ship let's do it it reminds me of mobile game ads that uh end up and not are not like the ad that's true i've been really playing so many of these games <laughs> I've been playing so many of them. I really like the ones where you can, um, oh, is the star tell us what? I like a map. I want to, oh, galaxy. Whoa. See, this is what I had fun with before. It's like, if we can actually explore. Whoa. Whoa. Okay. Uh, oh, 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 oh. Yeah, I wanted to see if we could see the galaxy. Can we see the galaxy so that you system look up? Oh, so you can look at the coordinates? Because I was I wanted to make sure hazard system. Galaxy. Okay. So I wanted to like make sure that you guys could join my alliance. But I really like ones where you get to explore and like map out things because that's <gasps> oh, they're like connected and you got to go like between them. Ooh, I see. I see. I see. I see. And there's planets too. It feels like No Man's Sky Mobile and I kind of love it. <laughs> I kind of, I kind of live for it. Okay. Go to where? Assign your new recruit to your ship. How? How do I do that? How do I do that? I feel dumb chat. 
Oh, here? Oops, I didn't I didn't mean to. Manage. Assign. Ah, our new guy. Okay. Confirm. Now I can upgrade the ship. I want to make it pink and pretty. That's my goal. Uh, shield, warp, laser. I want our warp to be cool so we can go faster maybe, but probably enhancing the shield is the best. And then we need to get resources, which I don't think we have maybe. That's our ship A. Can we upgrade our like players or like info? Can we upgrade her? These are our kawaii like OG. So obviously we should give her some love. There we go. She's better now. The queen. The queen. Let's do it. Okay. Also, we have a promo code. How do we use that? Uh, as you recruit more officers, remember to assign them to your ships and strengthen your fleet. All right. Got it. I think... Uh, as officers gain more experience, you can level up and enhance their abilities. Choose an officer, increase their level. Remember to level up your officers regular to maximize. I already did that. I was going to say, I already did it. So, <laughs> oopsies. Um, okay, I detect two ships. One of them hauling. Okay, so these are the bad. Okay, so we got to go destroy them. Okay. Let me go back. I think I'm gonna go to sleep. No worries. Thank you so much. Go get more rest. Thank you for hanging out from, from Argentina. Good night, good night. Okay. Let's see what our um, universe notification graphic settings language notification. How do we use our promo code? Let's use that. Maybe events claim? Yo, those are spicy. Um, where where do we do that? Away artifacts, territories, um, item ships, officers. How do I see that? I know that they told me how to do it on my page. I can go back and check it. How we use our our promo code? You would think it would be here. Let me look. Sorry for the delay, chat. Okay, I didn't realize this. It says that you gotta make sure your VPN and ad block is off when downloading the game or it might not count. Keep that in mind. <laughs> Check your brief for details on how, okay, let me see how to use the promo code. Cause I think this is like by making the account. Where do I use the promo code? Promo code, promo code. I got my brief. Okay. Yo! Ghosty! Thank you so much for the follow! Welcome to the Poopa Squad! Thank you so much! Thank you, thank you, thank you! Okay. Uh, use the creator link, download, once in game. Top left corner, open settings, choose general, scroll down, very end. Uh, oh, you have to have an ID to use it. And then select redeem code from there. Okay, so, well, we gotta make an account anyway. We can do that. Do, 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 do. Okay, agree, making the account. Open Gmail. <laughs> Okay, 
Okay. That should count. Ta da! We did it. Ready. Oh, wow. The whole website is cool. Although, I don't know how to. Uh, did it. I don't know how to redeem that. Might be a dumb dumb. I can redeem the code though. Our code is warp speed, I think. Ta da! Oh, there it is! Yo, we get 10 extra for like a purple guy. That's pretty good. Okay. So that's how you redeem your code, I suppose. I see. Okay. We did it! Okay, sorry. Back to the game. I wanted my goodies. Defeat the Noshin ship. Okay. Um, attack. Kind of far away. I guess it's not that far. We got the zoomies. Chat, what are you guys up to this weekend? Do you have any fun plans? I'm really excited for New Year's wishes and to just go through and like reminisce about like fun things we've done in the past. I think that's going to be so fun and everything and yeah defeat the bar like ship okay i was gonna say did we did we not defeat it before <laughs> i was like scared for a second it was like did it not work right all right you may have defeated me but govalar will not fail i don't know man where I don't think I I I don't think so. Commander, uh, the realists soon to face enemies are too strong to take down. If you stand a chance of stronger enemies, you'll need to upgrade the ship. Okay, let's do it. Let's do it. Okay, so do we need to like go to like a home base to be able to like upgrade our ship? I'm assuming. All right. First, add components. Tear up the ship. Okay. How do we do that? Okay, we need to repair it. Which is free to up uh, to instantly repair it, which is nice. Sign officers, upgrade the ship. Uh, we have quite a bit. So I think shield. Okay, we upgrade the shield and then the warp. And then we have two little like blasters and we can upgrade. Wait, we have enough to upgrade all three or all four. Let's go. And then we can tear up. Ooh, tear up. And it's free. Yay! Okay, well, we don't have enough to upgrade again. So that's as good as we're gonna get right now. <laughs> At least it's 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 better, right? And then can, we don't have any more. Yeah, we don't have any more to assign. Can we upgrade him? Yeah, we can. Kind of scary. His face is he's, he's very pale, but he kind of looks like he's he's a little scary, just a little bit. Don't I'm sorry. Okay, we'll upgrade her again and then I guess we can upgrade him again. Yeah. We'll upgrade him one last time and then look at he looks uh good to go. Ta-da! All right, now what? Regularly upgrading your ship will maximize the power of your fleet. Let's go, Commander. I'm receiving a distress call from the Starfleet Science Vessel. Let's go help them out. Um, hi, Venice. How are you doing? I hope you're having a good day. Happy Lunar New Year. Um, one of my favorite characters of a series I've never really watched. Oh my gosh. <laughs> It's like fun that there's so many like characters and everything in the crossover from it. Captain Morcona, thanks for responding to our distress call. Our own away team discovered a strange artifact on an unpopulated planet, but we were raided by Nosh Noshican pirates and, and now the artifact belongs to me. No, we're going to go bonk his buns. 
Don't worry. We'll bonk his buns real good. <laughs> Um, and okay, thank you. His work was blurg. Aw, I hope your day gets better, though. I see maybe 10 episodes in total, but five of them were about data. Yo, I st I've actually never watched Star Trek. And, uh, like, I always feel bad. We Like, I talk to Ash about it a lot. And I'm always like, oh, man, I definitely need to because it's one of Ash's, like, most favorite ever. And there's, like, I've seen all the Star Wars, so I might as well watch some Star Trek, too, while I'm at it. Like, you know, do all the things. Hi, thank you. Uh, we retrieve the artifact. Let's go. Find the beacons or perish. Intriguing. You're welcome to keep it and continue your research. Um, what are we supposed to do? I forgot already. Are we supposed to be recruiting people, I think? Oh, that's what that costs. Oh, 800. For one chest. Okay, let's do it. Okay, let's see. What did we get? We got Yuki times one. Six of 11 times one. Um, Gary... Oh, wow. I didn't think we were going to be opening so many. Gary Mitchell... Krell. Fuck! <laughs> Hardcore, Fenton Mud, Crass, Leonard, Merlina, As it Burr. Oh, not bad. Okay, okay. I was gonna say, like, do we have. Um. I was just looking to see, like, all the stuff. Oh, and then we can do one chest here. Oh, we got two of him, so we almost can recruit him. Okay, some of these commons, like, uh, are probably pretty good. Oh, XP, we'll take it. We'll take it. Thank you. I see. So different federations have different things that you can, and then you can pull for. So y'all see, y'all see. Well, we can open another chest, so might as well, right? Maybe we can do it as a movie night chat. We can watch it and play. Oh, we get eight pulls this time. Um, I've seen maybe 10 episodes. It was TV back when I was a teen. I've yet to watch the last two Star Wars and honestly not sure if I do. Never want the greatest Star Wars fans. Uh, don't get me wrong. I like to think they're good movies, but I'm bored with that. That's fine. Honestly, they, like some of the new ones are like fun, but yeah, it's not. I'm not. I'm definitely not like crazy about it either I, but i go back and like i always forget them it's like i need to do a marathon or something of them well we got a lot of epics oh, oh i went 10 of 11 oh no i'm gonna have to uh stop airpods give me one second i need to eat something i'm feeling kind of like uh lethargic the jellyfish it looks so cool i want it okay Analyze the device we receive of captain morcona and is unknown the ancient origin and appears as some kind of power it's upgrade. Yo, we'll take it. Dun, 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 dun. Okay, upgrade. Um, Want to accelerate your gameplay? Get a daily claim of XOR credits. Uh, what is it? Is it, do you have to pay for it? No events. It just says no events active. And I look at it. Dun, dun. Okay. All done. And we can speed it up. Ta da! 
So yeah, I, I might, I, I maybe we should like marathon stuff like that. I think it would be kind of fun. Can we unlock like more things in the base? Unlock a vault. Oh, oh, these are like, we gotta like research. Oh, we gotta do a lot. Okay. Level three. Operation. So this needs to be upgraded. Okay. And then we can instant level two. Uh, okay, I see. So, okay, over here, the operation needs to be upgraded. There's so much you can put in your ships, which is really cool, honestly. Um, Do I own a lot of them? Like, how many tokens do I have? 10 minutes, two times, I mean, sure. Yay, regular upgrades will allow you to enhance the station and expand its capabilities. We'll continue my research. Cool, we're level three now! Okay. So then we need to like upgrade these more. And <laughs> the upgrading, it goes on and on. And then let's upgrade this one. I think we can just speed those up for free. <laughs> and oh level 22 level 8 thank you so much i got the eggy bites chat thank you ah thank you i'm feeling like shaky i feel like i needed to eat more so thank you so much i cancel find the worth of mm -hmm. Me one second, chat. I'm gonna eat a bite. All right. Well, we completed our mission. Um, we can collect. All right. In the meantime, um, let's swap back to uh, Genshin for a little bit. We did a chunk of some stream. We checked out the game. We're going to be grinding to uh, make our alliance and stuff. So feel free to uh, join my alliance in the meantime. Oh my gosh, how long was my thing for my VTuber on screen and I didn't have it off? I'm a dummy. Right, let's play some more. by Star Trek um, Fleet, Command, uh, Fleet Command, which is fun. Um, we've been doing that and trying to grind. I'm still working on hitting level five and we're hanging out and everything. If you guys would like to check it out, you can do exclamation star. It's already in the chat though, right there. 
Um, but yeah, we still need to check out Naraka too. And but I've been wanting to play Genshin. Genshin has a ton of stuff going on. And hi, you did arrive in the meantime. Thanks for hanging out and everything, chat. I need to eat something really quick. <laughs> I wanted to watch Mizu Live Hero. Yo, we're trying. I do have a guild or an alliance you guys can join. So if you guys want to join them, that's one of our goals is to get five people in my alliance. So that'll be exciting. All right. Let's go back to our quest. How is everybody doing today? And then tomorrow we're doing our New Year's wishes. I'm really excited. Okay, what were we working on? Hmm, I haven't done this one, which I think we should do. Oh, wait, what quest are... What is this? What quest are we on? But it's telling us we have to do. <laughs> Not that one. Not that one. Not that one, is it? Not that one. I don't know. It's not that one either. <laughs> uh, that's what's coming. I bet. I don't know. I don't know. We'll do this, though. I'm not sure which one. We'll do the wolf one. Toot, toot, toot. Baller, hi. How are you doing? Tooth, hello. All right, let's do it. This is Wolvendom. The ones that hardly ever come here. Even though it's not so far away from the city, the environment here is totally untouched. It's a wild place ruled by the laws of nature. Mm. It's survival of the fittest out here. Even the slimes around here are huge. Like those super duper massive ones over there. Oh yeah, they're coming this way. <laughs> and they're chunky. Ha. Paimon, you almost got us killed. Look at you go. Not so fancy and scary now. Who is that handsome lad? Thank you. Uh, do not worry. Uh, wolves, friends. But mm. you are? You are? We are just some friends too. travelers passing through. Don't smell boring. You smell familiar. We what does that mean? You smell like Knights of Favonius. They are friends. Are you one also I am one? Razor. I am no knight. Oh. Uh, oh. What's with the wolf pack? My wolf pack. They are my family. Oh, he's Your a wolf family? boy! Yes. They raised me. We live together. We are family. <laughs> so many questions. Mm, they are angry with me. I help you. Exposed our ambush. Boar ran away. Aww. Uh, don't worry. Paimon will get her friend to catch you another boar. She's stronger than she looks. N no, 
No need. When knights try to help, wolves go hungry. Oh. Don't be silly. Wait here. We won't screw this up. Just watch. We better get them. Oh, traps. What? Mm. There's traps? How do we do that? Oh, well, it's not going to make us do it. We just can give them raw meat, which I already have. I think wolves catch five or six every hunt. <sighs> Tonight they go hungry. Oh no! We need more. Uh, oh. Don't worry. You tried. At least you did better than other night friend. The red one. Bernie girl. Uh, Bernie girl. If she girl. was here, whole mountain is fire. Can't catch even one boar. <laughs> Man, I must go. Amber's now. that bad, huh? Here is not safe. Careful, always watching. He's so mysterious. What a weirdo, Bernie girl, from the Knights of Favonius. What is he? Hmm. Who do you think it is? Yeah, I mean, nobody likes Amber, unfortunately, besides her personality. <laughs> poor, poor Amber. Poor Amber. She's so unloved. She can't catch a break. Poor thing. I mean, she's nice. But... Ah, uh, rip. <laughs> unfortunate, unfortunate, poor Amber. I maxed her out before realizing that they are other champions. <laughs> and then you're like, man, she's really cute though, and I like her voice actor. Hi, Paimon. Hi, Traveler. What can I do for you? I like her outfit. Hi, Amber. Amber, something has come up. Amber, do you know a wolf boy from Wolvengum? Who? He said you guys hit it off like a mountain on fire. <laughs> what? what on earth are you talking about? Strange. He said he would wait for you at your regular spot. Did you lose your memory or something? My memory is fine. But you've been eating magic matsutake again, haven't you, Paimon? I Magic have no Matsutake. idea what you're talking about. Magic Matsutake? Hmm. No, no. Remind not the me what color they are? Purple. I flower patch kits because I'm. Simon may have had a couple the other day. Oh, but box. that's not the point. Simon's not loopy. Do you really not know that boy that lives with the wolves? I don't know what you're talking about. Maybe she's protecting him. On the him. subject of wolves, I've been investigating something recently. In the past, the wolves never dared venture outside of Wolvendom, but now they're getting braver. Sorry, chat for the crinkle. I heard they attacked a cart fleet near Drunkard Gorge. If you have time, could you come and check out the situation with me? Uh, sure. We're gonna... Uh, wait, so he... Why is she acting like she doesn't know him? Awesome. I knew I could count on you. Let's go. Your mommy Mizu, I mean, Amber is really <laughs> cute. To be fair. I just don't like using her as a character. <clears throat> Hold on. I got Sour Patch Kids! Look, up ahead! Something's happening. That ain't no wolf pack. Looks like it's the hilly trails attacking the carts after all. Huh. Not such a mystery after all. Enough talk. Let's go help out. Don't worry. We're on the case. Sorry, my, I feel like my mommy voice isn't very good. My voice is like all yeah. messed up still from being sick. Bless you. Piece of 
cake. So, the hilly churls have been starting to flex their muscles on the back of the wool scare. That's right. But I must say, if you think the hilly churls are a nasty lot, the wolves are even worse. They... they attacked Springvale this morning. Springvale? That's crazy! It's unheard of. I thought I would take my chances on the road after the wolves had their fun. I never thought the hilly churls would show up too. We should head there soon and see how bad the situation is. But first things first, you should assess the damage to your cart. Does it still work? I'll take a look. All right. What happened in the town? Oh dear. This is awful. Poor lad can't even stand. That's terrible. Except he's not actually injured. Yeah, there's nothing wrong right. with him. It's awful. The wolves frighten him so badly that he's paralyzed with fear. What? That really is awful. Do you remember any significant details of what you saw? Hi. Thank you for having me. I've never Hi, seen a wolf in my How life you before doing? today. It was terrifying. No details then, huh? Let's investigate the area again. Yeah, he's injured of fear. He's a big old wimp. These claw marks. From them, we can tell the number and size of the wolves. This time, there were at least two wolves. And they must be... Uh -huh. Yes, yes. They must be at least two meters high. Uh, Paimon, do you know what a wolf is? <laughs> hey, wolves are mysterious creatures. It's not like you see them every day. Aw, uh, thank you for the head pats. Thank you. I hope that your, um, your migraine goes away and you feel better soon. Huh? Sending you all the love. This is a wolf's tooth. He must have smashed into the door when he pounced. Think of the hydrate. Uh, anyway. Have you seen a wolf in real life? how no one in the village got seriously injured. Hey, yo! We had, um, a pack of them in our yard one time, and it, it killed a, a elk across the river from our house. <laughs> and then they harassed our, 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 uh, our horses one time. Kind of spooky. Wolfer. I heard that in Liyue, they make calligraphy brushes out of this and stuff. A bear got, uh, we the had a bear and a ring doorbell like earlier this year, which was funny. Say. Could it be that they're from somewhere else entirely? Hair looks different at every place on the body. Same applies to wolves. You don't know where it's from. But look at this. Another hair. But what's that stuck to it? A seed? It's the seed of a wolf hookberry. Look, there are little hooks on the seed. The only places this grows in Mondstadt are Wolvendom and Brick Emotional Park damage! So Wolvendom wolves after all? From that area, yes. But it could be that there are other wolf packs encroaching on their territory. This doesn't tell us everything, but it does give us a strong lead. Enough to start investigating. I'll go and see to the villagers before we head off. Um, yeah, it's kind of spooky. You know, we usually go shoo them off or pop a shot off in the air to scare them off because we don't want them coming in front of our house. Usually it's not an issue because we have dogs and they pee everywhere. And so they don't come around, but occasionally they get a bit brazen. Um, and if it becomes a problem, we have to call like fishing game to relocate them. At least with the bear. Um, but with the wolves, it's only happened a couple times, but... 
yeah, when that when they're around, you're like, mm, I have a fenced area, but don't let the dogs out. How is your investigation Spooky. coming along? My dogs don't like it either. What? Their hair flares. Yes, I see. Such a hypochondriac. I have recovered, thankfully. I managed to claw my way back out of the depths of hell. Bro. So, Knights of Favonius, what have you found out? I've seen wolves too, and I wasn't much at the paralyzed with fear like you, sir. We can tell that the wolves came from Wolvendom. Beyond that, we don't know anything. But please remain calm. I what am I doing? Wolvendom I'm eating sour and get to the bottom of this. The Knights of Favonius will not allow this danger to continue any longer. Good. Better late than never, I suppose. How rude! In the meantime, we'll just have to keep dealing with this on our own. Please, don't do anything stupid. <laughs> we do things a bit differently around here. You Favonius lot probably aren't used to it. They will pay for what they've done. G <laughs> Goodbye. Um... These people have tood. It's awful. Really is. What is? Their future outlook, I mean. Young people could be so impulsive sometimes. If it's not too much to ask, I hope you can keep an eye on them. Stop them from getting into trouble. It's no trouble. That's what we're here for. Even though that guy really isn't much of a charmer. Leave it to us. Uh, off to Wolvendom we go. That's a nice way of putting it, man. At least Amber is more civil than I would be. I got too much tood to be to be as calm as Amber in all these these types of situations. Ooh, we can get these beautiful flower. Okay. Time to go to Wolvendale. But we before we do. We can go check over here. And get all the spicy ore. <laughs> hey there. Hey there. <laughs> Alright. Think of it the head pat. All right, and thank you everyone for just hanging out with me while we play some games. Being all cozy, I appreciate y'all. Bum, 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 bum. Okay, now we go to find Razor. Okay. Oh, hello, Mr. Seely. I have to come back for him. Who's there? Chill out, Razor. It's only us. You are also Knight? So, you don't know each other after all? Uh, the red one, Bunny Girl? No. This girl also red, but not so Bernie like other girl. What? This is starting to make sense. Is this the wolf boy you were talking about? Who is the Correct. other Bernie red Razor. Bunny Girl? Help me out. What? With what? No time. I sent Lupa call away. People coming. Bad people. Those guys from earlier? I understand. But first, I have a few questions. <sighs> I smell blood. <sighs> Quick. <laughs> I like the noir. Blood. Thank you. I hope the wolf... Oh, sorry. I didn't mean to click through. Um, okay. The fate chosen Lupical. What happened? What happened? What happened? In Ely? Blood droplets. Not human blood. Wolf blood. Lupa call blood. Lupa what now? Are you gonna tell us what it means yet? Lupa call is family fate gave me. When wolf accepts human as its own, or human accepts wolf, that is Lupa. Sounds like gibberish to me. That's strange. Where does the word come from? Surely it wasn't made up by the wolves. It's just the name he gave. Who's he? Guardian of this land. Wouldn't that be Barbados, though? He is the ruler of Mondstadt. Enough. Another clue. 
follow me. <laughs> hey, wait! He's a mysterious wolf boy. Your innocence. <sighs> He's already gone. I mean, it seems like his family is under attack, so you know. Yeah! Yeah! Uh, yeah! <laughs> I want to be a voice actor for the hilly trolls. That's a lot of big poopa scratches. Those are like big, big poopa scratches. Oh no. This is him. We find his blood. Oh no, he's Bad still breathing. Did this. Oh, how terrible. I do agree that it's awful, but that doesn't change the fact that we didn't attack village. Not us! A black wolf and his pack. Not from here. They tried to take over land. They broke the code. Whose code? Guardian of this land. That's now the second time you've brought that up. Tell us who that is. I take Lupa call further in. Follow me. Maybe you see. It's very mysterious. I'm glad you guys like uh uh the sh the the blah, 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 the filters. We actually have more than that. We just haven't made uh, commands for them yet. We got a pink one and kind of like a dreamy one, and then we got like a low that pixel. That one from earlier was two meters high. Imagine how high this one must That's be. That's a big poopa print. Big What's poopa this? print. They're so huge. That's a big scratch scratch. Oh. <coughs> Moochies for chat! <coughs> Help Finger me. Head pack. Collect these. Lonnie Chow, psychotic symbol! Aren't those wolf hook seeds? Crush them. Put on wound. Bleeding stop. It's true. Wolfhook seeds have a liquid coating that not only functions as a mild painkiller, but also has a hemostatic effect. I read that in a book. Why? I have no idea. Hooks help seeds move. Liquid stops pain and bleeding. Animal doesn't feel hooks. They take seeds far away. Purple teacher told me so. I stay here. Take care of this one. I answer Red Girl's questions. Right. And if that lot does come back, I doubt they will try their luck against a member of the Knights of Favonius. Your wolf friend is not clear of my suspicion just yet, but we'll still need to fetch those seeds. At least we can save him. Wee 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 How do we leave? Okay, I had to, I had to take a moment. Oh wait, I already have some. Whoopsies! Do 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 do. That's Leaker Pill, my husky puppy. Have I have Hi, Minnie Man. Yes, enough. Razor was just telling me about the Wolven Code of Conduct. Mind-blowing stuff. Uh, thank you. We've looked everywhere and haven't seen any other wolves. <sighs> yep, that's wolves for you. The one we managed to capture must have been sick or something. There's them buttheads. <laughs> Beat him up! What are you doing here? Revenge. It's him! The one who was raised by wolves! Huh? So, it was you! I should have known wolves aren't smart enough to be behind this! I can't believe you would help wolves plot against humans! They throw you some scraps and you treat them like kin? Have you forgotten what you are? Enough! You can't talk about um, like that. these ones should just the be Knights special, uh, like normal guy off? Genshin drops we just for watching. It should pop up on your screen, finish. and you can go check out the inventory under drop section what if you want to see what's all available. What? I also, why are we Razor it? right now? <sighs> this is no offering to Boreas. Oh. No. 
not only do you come for my kind so too do you fail to recognize your own transgression oh no Wait, are we gonna attack the big poopa? Um, do I have any experience with bobcats? No, actually not really. Not too much. We're like doing no damage to him as <laughs> Razor. Not, not too much. We do have them here, but they don't really come around. We have a lot. We have cougars instead. So those are mostly a problem. The lynx and the bobcat, I've seen them around. I think I saw, I've seen both of them like once or twice in the wild, but they're, they're not that big. They don't tend to cause issues. Um, I think more rural, like, uh, more rural, I guess, areas that are more populated than where I am but not in the mountains probably have more issues with them with like oh. them attacking your animals and stuff but around here we got bigger baddies lurking around you know drop your weapons oh he heals too oh my gosh she's got the zoomies this really feels like a like a, a okami bo like boss fight so cool It's a big linger poo, I know! <sighs> and I couldn't take one in a fight, but I totally could. <laughs> Please, calm. I mean, they're mean. They, they'll kill your pets and stuff, so it's I mean. Just like he said. An outside wolf pack coming in and breaking the rules. They will reap what they have sown. But Razor, you must not get involved. This is for the wolves to settle between themselves. You fight not with claws, but with the sword. You strike not with teeth, but with lightning. You are human, Razor. I am not like them. I don't belong. You are no wolf. This is a matter for the wolves, and the wolves alone. And you. You are Razor's Lupacar amongst humans. Your nobility stands out against others of your kind. If you ever wish, you may train with me. Ooh. I have nothing further to say. May we meet again, Razor and company. Ow! Hey, Razor, what's that look for? Why don't you come to the city for a few days? Yeah, you have a friend in Mondstadt anyway, right? You know, that red Bernie friend of yours? You're not safe in the wild anymore. But I know that you don't want to hurt them. I'm fine, don't worry. But I'm not city human. But also, not wolf. Aww. Thank you, Traveler, Paimon, no, he's and... not welcome anywhere. Red girl? Hey! We've been with you all this time, and you still don't even know my name? Goodbye. Goodbye! <laughs> and nor do I want to. The meaning of Lupica. Now we can challenge him. Look at the big sword. Big fancy sword. Ooh! Cool! Where are we supposed to go now? Oh, that's it, I think. Oh, it just probably added to maybe like story quests and stuff. Cool beans! Cool beans! That was a little bit of razor. We unlock new area, the big wolfer pooper guy. Pretty cool, pretty cool, pretty cool. 
Whoa, whoa, whoa. Thank you guys for watching the ad and supporting the channel. It helps a ton. Hello, hello. Hi, Castoraka. How are you doing? I mean, to be fair, Bobcats aren't that big. How big are they? Probably pick one up. Let's see. How big is a Bobcat? Um, yo, they're, gosh, they're smaller than I thought. Because the links are pretty small, too. 14 to 40 pounds and 8 and at 0 0.8 pounds to 34. They're pretty small. I mean, they'll still kill, like, small animals to get you a small dog or cat. That's, like, a pretty big issue. But you're probably right. I mean, here you go. Here's someone holding one. Um, You, might, you know what? You might be able to beat one up. Uh, Manny man, you might be right. I, I'll, I'll, I'll concur to that. You might, you might be able to, to beat one up. Yeah, they're smaller than my dog. Linker Poo weighs like 72 pounds. And know that, that showcase their pet links. And of course the lady is Russian. Honestly, like it's kind of crazy. So many people do actually have them. You guys, let's do, let's, let's, let's ascend our world. Should we do it? Do we do it, chat? Meow meow. I forgot that I got to see a lynx, uh, probably one of the rarer ones to see. You don't see him much. One time I saw, I don't remember if it was a bobcat or a lynx, but I saw it when we were out floating the river. And then as soon as you saw it, it ran away. It was like a super not like, I don't know. It, it, it was, it was, it's pretty, they're pretty skittish. I don't know. Maybe I'll wait to ascend because I feel like then it's going to be like uh, too much grinding, too much. Gr so yeah, they're pretty, they're pretty like skittish, you know, you don't see them very often. They're not, I mean, I've seen a mountain lion more times than I've seen a, a bobcat or a lynx. And, and, and cats too, like you, they see you before you say them. That's for sure. Mm hmm mm hmm mm hmm I was thinking. Maybe I'll wait. I don't know what I want to do. Chat, I'm gonna be honest, I really don't feel very good. I got kind of like the... Like the shakes. And I ate dinner and stuff. And then now that I've eaten I am feeling better, I ate some Sour Patch Kids too. And I ate a cookie. And it has some egg bites, but I feel like really like really shaky and just really weird. So I'm thinking that um I might end stream because tomorrow tomorrow we're gonna be we're gonna be uh hanging out and celebrating um Chinese New Year's or well Lunar New Year's and um we're gonna be doing that and that's gonna be super fun and then we'll also be um, just hanging out. I do have another sponsor that starts tomorrow with, uh, Factor 75. And I probably in my O time, I'll grind my, my star check a little bit. Um, if you guys want to download, make sure you guys download the game and check it out as well. Um, if you guys would. Also, it said something about that it doesn't count if you have, like, an ad block or a VPN on when you download it. Uh, at least on, um, PC. So keep that in mind. <laughs> Keep that in mind because uh, that might be a thing. I don't know. So yeah. Um, but yeah. Thank you so much for hanging out. Let me pick. I don't know. Can we do the bookworm one maybe? Yeah, that would be fun. Do the bookworm one next. Okay. But I think I'm gonna end. I'm sorry today was kind of like a funky monkey stream and I was all over the place. I just don't feel very good. So yeah. I mean, I think it's probably for the best to, <laughs> to end stream, though. Thank you so much for all the support. Thanks for hanging out with me. Thanks for everybody chilling stuff. Thank you to everyone who's downloaded the game. And yeah, I know it'll take a little bit to grind those levels. I can't wait for us to all join in the same little fleet tomorrow and everything or this week. So <laughs> thank you so much. Can I raid that I don't need to socialize with? I can just go to bed. <laughs> Sorry 
to end chat. Yeah, I just got like, I don't know. I feel like really shaky and weird. So I was like, I should probably just go to bed. You know? I'll get some sweepies. And uh, tomorrow's stream will start two hours earlier. So uh, save the date for that. We'll be starting two hours earlier and making wishes. And it's going to be super cute and fun. You guys want to watch someone making Legos? This is Monsta, and she is making um, some Legos to celebrate uh, Lunar New Year. Well, let's go give her some love. Thank you so much for hanging out. Please join the Discord to keep up to date with everything. Um, you can download the um, Dharma doll that you see down below. My elbow over here. Um, if you guys would like to participate in the wish making with them. Also, please check out my other socials and um, check out the YouTube. We've been posting a lot and all the support and everything. Uh, thank you guys so much for hanging out and everything. Good night, Nugget. Good night, good night. I really appreciate y'all. I hope you have a good sleep tomorrow. We're gonna have tons of fun. Again, yeah, starting two hours earlier than today. So 7 p.m. Mountain Standard Time, which is 6 p.m. Pacific, which is uh, 9 p.m. Eastern. So that's when we're gonna be starting. And we're just gonna be making wishes and reminiscing and playing some different games and stuff. And yeah! So I hope you guys have a wonderful night. Uh, the new event with Bruce Lee is out for Naraka. There's so much exciting stuff. And then on the 14th, we're going to be doing a date with Mizu. And it's going to be exciting. So, yeah. I will see you guys soon. And good night, everyone. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Spam. Oh, yeah. The raid message. <laughs> good night, everyone. Let's get some good sleepies. Good night. Good night. Bye-bye.